Welcome back, people. We've got some more Ultimate Fishing Simulator for you guys here today. A little bit of a later stream. I'm probably going to be pushing the streams kind of back to this sort of time now because from tomorrow, all the kids are going back to school. So I'm obviously going to need to take my kid to school, pick my kid up from school, that kind of thing. So, yeah, from now, from now on, I might start streaming at this time. Guys, I don't think I've ever seen you before, man. So if you're new here, oh, you are new. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Welcome to the channel, man. How's it going, Pulse? Good to see you again. How's it going, Jane? Hello, Tilly. All right, let's get into it. All right, here we go. So I've been catching a few marlin. Not as much as I would like to catch, as I'm honest. But I can catch some of the small ones, and <laughs> I say small ones, around about 200-ish pounds, two, 300 pounds. I can catch that, but anything bigger than that is a little bit, is a little bit of a struggle. So, yeah, there is that to bear in mind. We might not pull in every single fish, but I, instead of using the 12 hook, I put on the hash 10. So that way I can kind of avoid some of the smaller, uh, the bigger ones and maybe hook up some smaller ones. I've managed to pull in a few and I have got some better line now. That's the line that I'm using there. Let me just quickly show you that here. Uh, okay, so here, 88 pounds. I said if I hit level 20, we'd be good, but no, that's wrong. I gotta be level 21. When I hit level 21, we'll be able to get this, this line here, 142 pound. So 142 pounds, and then the same goes for the rod. When we hit, <coughs> when we hit level 21, I'll be able to get this rod here. So durability is a bit is a bit better. So I need to hit level 21. That's what I need to do. Let me just um, buy some more bait real quick. I've leveled up a little bit. I think the last time we streamed this, I was level coming up towards level 20. So I was 19, but close to 20. Now I'm 20, about halfway through level 20. It does take a short minute to level up. Level 20 doesn't sound very high, if I'm honest, but it does take. It definitely takes a minute to to get that level. One thing I have noticed though is if I come onto here. And I go around like this. Hold on, give me one second. Just wanna, okay, just check, make sure we do have audio on the game. Yeah, we do. All right, we're good. Yeah, so I've noticed that the more I drive the boat around, there we go. I didn't even need to drive it around. But the, yeah, I've noticed that we control on here. So instead of me staying in one place, I've noticed if I just keep moving around a lot, if I move around a lot more, then you definitely. You can hook them up easier, quicker. What is this? Honestly, I know it's not, but it does look like mackerel. <laughs> I know it's not, though. It's running well. So this rod that I'm using at the minute, this one's not the, the strongest of rods. The other one on my right there is a little bit better than this one that I'm using. So I can put more strain on the other one. And the other one, if I catch a good fish, I'd rather catch it on the other rod compared to this one. So that's why on this one I put some large cut bait. I don't plan on catching marlin with this rod. That just would not be ideal. It, yeah, it makes it nearly impossible. And I've been... Basically, I haven't been keeping any money either. I've been releasing every fish that I'm catching. Because if we release the fish, we get that a little bit more XP. See, we got 328. I could keep it for 271 cash. Or release it to get an extra 65 XP. So that's pretty much what I've been doing. My money hasn't gone up much. I think we had about 80,000 before. And now we've got like 81,000. So it has gone up a little bit, but not by much at all. Because most of it, I have been releasing. So yeah, getting on the boat and just driving around slowly is a really good idea. Now we can go faster, 
But if we go too fast, we're not going to hook anything up like that. So kind of not not worth it. It's kind of pointless. The graphics on this game do look awesome. I love how good it looks. I'm quite looking forward to the the next one as well. The Ultimate Simulator 2. That's going to be good. Let me just take that. Oh, well, my chair's a little bit. There we go. All right, let me do that. Just see if that's a bit better. I literally can't hear. It's all I hear is the game. I can only hear the game. That boat's so loud. I, don't, I hope. There we go. That's a bit better. Take the mic gain up. So then big dots. Then big dots are the ones that we want to hook up for the marlin. The other dots are, are alright. They will. They will catch us some of the other fish. Some mahi and some of those ones that we just caught. I forgot. I didn't even look at the name of that fish actually. <laughs> I should have done. Never mind. Oh, there's a big one over that way. There's a really big fish over that way. There's a few there. None weren't interested. I wasn't really positioned that great. Oh, hold on. Oh, no, he's coming for it. I think I think he's coming for it. He's coming for it. I'm sure he is. Yeah, I, I thought he was. You see, that's how we do it. <laughs> that's pretty cool. All right, here we go. We got a marlin. It's not guaranteed that I'm going to bring every single one of these in, but... I can definitely try. As long as it's not more than around about 400 pounds, I should be able to get it. Before I kept on striking a lot and I was reeling a lot and that's what made me lose the fish. I've noticed if I don't do that and I just keep on tapping keep the real drag up to max and then keep it around anything between 60 to around about 70 seems to be good guess what I got daddy McDonald's <laughs> you got daddy McDonald's what I am eating Kelsley breakfast. Okay. Oh, come on. This will stop running. As long as it's not too big, we, we should be able to get it. Oh, there we go. It's coming back my way. Yeah, there we go. <clears throat> no, he's trying to run again. Now I'm reeling it back in a little bit. Now I was saying, thinking about it, I was saying about Fishing Planet, about it's a little bit ridiculous on how long it's taken to reel in. Now, me saying that, this game does take a little bit of time to reel in as well, but the difference is here, you can catch fish over a thousand pound. A fish over a thousand pound, obviously it's going to take a short minute to reel it in, of course it is. If I, if I know I'm going to be pulling in a fish anything between 300 pound upwards or two pound, 200 pound upwards, I, I expect it is going to take a short minute. <clears throat> there we go. Sometimes they run at the last minute, so it's a good idea to take the drag down a little bit. Oh, there you go. Well, that's not too bad. What was that? 228 pounds. 
and gave us 1,700 wall. My chair's wobbling. 1,715 XP. I'm going to release it because that gives us another 343. As again, Savage Boss. Good to see you, man. Yeah, that's really good. Keep catching fish like that and we'll level up quicker than what I want to. It, is, it does definitely take a short minute. I didn't think for me to get to level 20 would take that long. I was playing a little bit yesterday. And after we did a stream yesterday on Tony Hawk. So then after playing that, I came and played this for a little bit. I thought I hit level 21 and then be able to show you guys the better rods and the better line and stuff. But it, it's taken a, it has definitely taken a short minute. Let me turn around, let's go faster. So some of them little small dots. I know I definitely will catch some of those. But they're not marlin. Look how good the picture quality looks. That's insane. That looks so good. one over there it's only just one by itself though so not too bothered I say that and now a few of them appear there one there as well I'm not quite sure which way is the quickest way to either either stay in one spot either stay in one spot or keep trolling around like that it does work quite well when I troll around this one if I put this one out this one's only got cut bait on I don't expect to catch a big fish with that because this rod isn't too good either so well, it's good, but it's not good for big fish. Oh my, wow. That's what I mean by there's big fish here. Somebody caught a black marlin. 1,384 pound. That is absolutely insane. It ain't going to be long until we're catching those boys. It's not going to be long. I need to, need to get to level 21 so I can get that better rod, get the better line. I might even, I probably could get a better reel than what I've got as well, so. Wow, what is this on here? Okay. For a second, I was thinking it was Marlin. That was fighting really well. Speed in reel, speed in reel. Come on. I like the waves. Looks great. I always take the drag back down because otherwise after. If it's got max drag, there's a good chance we'll end up losing it. So Rainbow Runner, 385 XP. We'll release it, gives us another 77. Yeah, I'm not. I think it's probably better that I troll around. They hook up so much quicker. It looks so good as well. I love. I love looking at that. The graphics are insane. As again, Trippy, good to see you, man. Look at the reflection of the water. It looks so good. Go a bit faster. There's nothing there. Here we go. Oh wow, there's a big spot over there. I think I got something following though. 
Is that one following or not? No, it's not. Let me just see if I can try and catch up this bit here. Get right in the middle of this bit. There's some big mile in there. Oh, I think we got a bit. I think we got marlin coming. Yeah, we got a fish on. Here we go. Is it that one? I think it is. Yeah, it is. Oh, all right. Here we go. Fully concentrate. The car has some mechanical issues right now. Start a motor. Was sticking. Managed to unstick it, and now it has a check engine light on. Hmm. Does it still start up though? There's always a 50-50 with these fish at the minute. Just because of the gear that I'm using, I don't know. If it's too big where there's no where it's gonna end up despooling. I've managed to crack it so I don't keep on snapping the line, but if it's too big, it will end up despooling. I feel like this is the best method. Take the reel crank up to max and then keep the reel at 75% and just keep on tapping reel, hoping that it's gonna wear it down. <laughs> it's worked a few times though. Yeah, but the check engine, engine light's a new thing. Yeah, you're probably gonna have to take it into the garage, man. Oh, unless you got a, unless you got a manual book. Have you got a manual book on the car? Or oh, if not, type in the make of your car online and type in what you know different lights on the dashboard, and it'll tell you what that light means. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get this one. I think this one's too big. It's not backing down. 800 foot out, still going strong. Anything more than about three, 400 pound, I'm not going to be able to bring in. So that's definitely bigger than 400 pound. It's got to be. I can't, just cannot stop it. That is an absolute monster. 900 foot. We've lost that. There's no way. If I get that back now, I'd be quite surprised. Oh, I think it is coming back a little bit. Yeah, I'm getting it back. Oh my gosh, how am I getting that back? I don't know. 900 foot of line out there. If that was real life, I'd kind of feel nervous about 900 feet being... I don't even think we'd be able to get 900 feet on a, on a, on a reel, I don't think. Not on a rod. I'm sure you couldn't. Maybe you could if it was a really, really big heavy duty reel, possibly. 900 foot out, that's crazy. Yeah, I have a manual for it. Check engine light either. Check engine light is either a serious issue or just because the starter motor is the problem. Well, both of them are going to cost money, but with a bit of luck, it's not the. It's only the starter motor with a bit of luck. I'm very surprised I'm managing to reel this back. 900 foot. I don't know how much line I've got, but I know you can't. I don't think I've got more than a thousand feet of line. I'm very sure I haven't. We're getting it closer. Just got to be careful on this last bit because they can turn around just like that. 
Now he's going to run again. I can't read chat at the minute, guys. If anyone's saying anything, I will go back and read the comments. I don't want to take my eyes off this. It pulled me out 900 foot. If I manage to reel this in, it's going to be a good fish. It's going to be some serious XP. Oh, come on, man. Oh, that's running so strong. Come on, turn. <laughs> this is crazy. These are monster fish. Oh, no. Wow, almost lost it there. I had to back the reel off. I thought I got him back then. He started running again. Come on. Come on, big fella. I've had to put my, my reel down to 62. This has got to be around 400 pounds, surely. I haven't had a marlin fight me that well. Now, I did put on the 10 hook rather than the 12 in hope that I wouldn't get them bigger ones, but... There might be the odd, the odd bigger fish that might want some of it by the looks of it. Okay, I've got to keep an eye on it on this part in case it run turns around and runs again. 80 feet, 60, 50, 40, 30, we should have this. Whew. Well, it wasn't 400 pounds, but it was 381 pounds, and we got an achievement for that. That was uh, <laughs> black marlin. It's not very often I get black marlin, it's normally rainbow marlin. Is it rainbow marlin, I think it's called? I can't remember now. White marlin, I think. But yeah, 381 pound, that is insane. That's nearly 10 foot, stands bigger than me. Hey Bubbly, how are you? Uh, we're fishing in Piner's Bay Ocean. Wow, nice one. Yeah, that's a big fish, right? Look at that, 2,686 XP. That's why I want to get these, because by getting these fish, it's going to help me level up pretty quick. 537 if we release, of course I'm going to release it. Now, it would have given us nearly 3,000 cash, so some good money, but I have to keep on releasing it because I want that XP. I definitely, I need, I need to try and get XP. I need to get, once I get a 21, we'll be able to get the better rod, so then I'll be able to fight bigger fish. Instead of using a 10 hook, I'll be able to use a 12. How strong is your rod? 82k cash. Um, it doesn't actually say how strong the rods are. Look, it just says durability. Uh, whoa, my chair. <laughs> I gotta not lean to the left, otherwise the chair goes to tip. Um, rods, casting. So it's this one. Is it this one? Yeah, this one. So it says durability. 142 pound length yeah and then this one the durability is more but obviously that's going to be a stronger rod because that's level 21 that's why I need to hit level 21 so I can get that rod you fixed your chair with e-proxy I did but it's a little bit cranky man I still need to buy a new chair. I'm gonna gonna need to save up some cash. But if I move to the left, I'm gonna put both feet down. When I move to the left, whoa, whoa. <laughs> yeah, it's um, it's very wobbly. Oh, we're getting all them marlin today for sure. I like it. Yeah, one of the legs went on okay. I glued one of them. One of them was alright, then the other one I glued. And it just didn't take too well. But 
It beats sitting on the floor though. The graphics are amazing on this game compared to compared to other fishing games that I play. Hands down, this the graphics on this game is definitely the best. And for the fact that you can see the fish swimming under the water like that as well, I like that. I haven't even got the graphics max maxed out either. When I run it in 4K, it looks amazing. I don't want to do that though, because this game requires a lot more graphics compared to Fishing Planet. And me maxing out the graphics on this, plus using the same computer to stream. I'm pretty sure my computer can do it, but I don't want to stress it. Another fish on the rod as well. Okay, I don't think this one is as big because I managed to reel this one in a little bit easier. I say that, it's probably going to run on the last bit now. It doesn't, it doesn't matter though, I don't care for size at the minute, it's just that XP that I'm really after. I wouldn't have thought it was only £59, that's for sure. I would have thought it would have been a lot bigger than that, but... There's still another 500 XP there, well, a little bit over. Then you can do this, hunting mode, which I like that as well. That's pretty cool that you can do that. Is that rod going again? I thought that fish was going for it. Might stay here for a second. I'm trying to press hunter mode, but we got to wait for a second. Do you know what? This guy, I don't understand it. I just do not understand it. Every time I come and play, no matter what... Oh, there you go. Let me quickly say hello to him. Every time I come and play in different rooms, it doesn't matter what one I play in. That, what's his name? Fame Gore. I always end up in the same room as that guy. Random. I don't know how. Every single time, I'm always in the same room as him. Cool, look at the size of that one there. That one looks even bigger than the one I've got on. Let me see if I can crank the reel up 75. If I take the reel up any more than 75, the line would definitely break. 110%. This looks like it could be a good fish as well. It's taking me deep. Close to four. Oh, whoa! Almost broke the line. 400 foot. I'm very surprised that line didn't snap there. You just have to keep tapping it. Ch keep chipping away at it slowly. Rather than it rushing it. got to take your time. You can't take your eyes off the screen as well. Take your eyes on the, off the screen for a second. It's over. I said that, but I just took my eyes off the screen to read chat. <laughs> this is the one thing that I love about this game. I wish the mobile version had this. There is actually some pretty good mobile versions of fishing games. I have played a couple in the past. I haven't for a long time, but they are they are pretty cool though. There was one that I played quite a lot of. And I ended up stopped playing it. I can't remember the name of it now. I might actually have a look for it later. If I manage to find it, I might go on it. <clears throat> it was a pretty good one. Fifty-five feet. Oh wow! Turned around at the last minute. He's trying to dart. That's a good job. I, I was ready. I'm always ready when any when any, when I get to about 130 foot and I'm reeling it in. 
as soon as I get near 130 feet, I always get really ready to release the reel, just in case it does turn around like that and run. When it turns around like that, tries to run. Just hell, your line breaks most of the time. When you get the name of it, let me know. I want to try it out. Yeah, I will do, man. There was max level on it as well. I just, I just can't remember. It was such a long time ago. But it was a good game. Black Marlin again. Look at that. 1,745 XP. Release it. We get 348. Let's release. We're getting some insane XP. But it's still taking a very long time to level up though. <laughs> yeah. Let me just say hello to him again because I only put hi there. Just so you don't think I'm rude. I was chatting to him uh, earlier on because I was playing. A, I was playing a little bit before I set up a stream, and earlier on when I was talking to him, I said to him, "I always seem to see you in the same room. I don't know how it works." There's one over that way. Yeah, there's a big one over there. Don't forget to drop a like on the stream, guys, if you're enjoying some ultimate fishing simulator. I was about to say fishing planet then. <laughs> I kind of slowed it down. The graphics look insane, though. I love the graphics. That's what I do. I w normally, I try and look up so I can see the tip of that rod, but no, I don't bother. I just look at the floats. <sighs> okay, I'm getting seasick. <laughs> How's it going, Eric? Good to see you, man. I think I got some interest on this one. Have I? No, I haven't. No. Did you give up on... Uh, no, I haven't given up on Fish and Planet. I just... Just the update annoyed me, man. And I know that I've got to adapt to it. You know, everybody else has got to. I'm not, I'm not the only person who has to deal with the new update. Obviously, other people have got that update the same as me. So I have got to learn to basically put up with it. Personally, myself, if I didn't stream that game and people weren't bothered, I probably wouldn't play it anymore, in all honesty. But loads of people keep on asking me that. Am I still going to play it? Am I still going to play it? And obviously it's what you guys want to see I always try and do what you guys want to watch or if I stream something and I've always, I've always said if I stream something and you guys enjoy it and then I will do it again so in a way that kind of puts me on on the spot to do it <laughs> yeah it puts me on the spot to play it but I am still going to play it I'm just taking a little bit of a break for a minute I just want to play something different this game, it does take a long time to reel fish in, but here I'm catching fish a lot, lot bigger. There's a lot bigger fish here than what there is on Fishing Planet, that's for sure. I love all your videos and, all, and your voice is so calming for some reason. <laughs> Thank you, man. So, yeah, some people, some people are not, if I do other things, sometimes people are not interested in that, that literally the only thing they want to see is fishing planet. They don't want to see anything else. So, because I based it around, you know, I basically based my whole YouTube around fishing games, more fishing planet than anything else. But yeah, I based it all across fishing games. But I'm cool with that though because I I do like fishing games. So. I'm just not happy with that update for a minute. I've requested and spoke to them and tried talking to them about it, but yeah, they seems like they're not bothered and they're they're gonna keep it the way it is. So I gotta learn to adapt. This one is proper running.
I don't think I could take the reel up more than 62%. only give me a little fraction to reel it let me try I'm gonna try 75 nope 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 that was close almost broke it not 75 I didn't I'm surprised I'm reeling that back I didn't think I, I honestly didn't think I was gonna get that one normally I can put it at 75 but this one was fighting so strong it yeah I couldn't uh, with the songs it just runs through a playlist normally man I do need to upgrade it I definitely need to definitely need to upgrade the music it's been a short minute I just got to be even more careful now because I'm monetized if I don't want to end up playing something that ends up giving me a copyright strike. Am I reeling it back? Yeah, I am. Like, like this song. Anytime I hear anything with, with someone singing in it, it always makes me look at the player to make whoa, to make sure that it's not gonna um it's not gonna give me any copyright. Four sixty five XP fifty eight pound ninety four XP for releasing, so let's release that as well. I don't think I'm even though we are actually we have actually caught quite a lot of marlin so far, I'm gonna be honest. It's actually been going really well. But I don't think I'm going to hit level 21 today. I, don't, I just don't think I will. It's possible I could. Depending on how long I was going to play it. Yeah, it definitely takes a short minute though. we got some over that way. we still got one over this way. So we could hang here for a minute. Oh. Yeah, if you guys ever, no matter what fishing game I'm playing, if I ever play a fishing game and you write in chat, I will respond to people in chat, but if I'm streaming, I don't always see the comments in, in the chat because I'm looking at the chat on my YouTube, not the chat on the game. So if I'm not streaming, I'll always reply as long as I'm not making videos. Look how beautiful that looks. That looks stunning. I love that. It looks so good. I should get a bell on there. I did have a bell on there before. People are singing. It's copyright. It depends. Not every, not every person who sings is copyright. Oh wow, almost lost that. They had a good little fight. It was only 20 pound, but that put up a good fight. Nearly 200 XP just under for that. Well, actually, no, I think it was dead on 200. So majority of it, I am actually l releasing the fish. But then for some of them, I am selling them so I can buy some more bait back so I don't waste too much money because I'm going to need some bait back for buying more bait otherwise I'm not going to be able to buy the new rod now let's move around a little bit it's so loud in the boat it is so loud in this boat there's some big marlin up there oh well we got a, we got one running one's coming Marlin's coming for that. You see what I mean? That's why I kind of like trolling. Trolling is good fun. Actually catching insanely fast. 
Alright, how's it going, Arrow? Good to see you again, man. Hate YouTube copyright strike. It's a strange one. It can be kind of confusing to some people. It can. Can I crank it to 75? Yeah, 75 is alright. I just have to keep tapping the reel until until it wears down. Then when it turns around, reel like bonkers. <laughs> even if you type in on YouTube no copyright music, sometimes you can still, even though there's music that people's put on there, sometimes that can still be copyright because they might not claim the copyright straight away. But as time goes by, they could then end up claiming copyright strike on it after a month or a year or even two years. So if you don't ever want to take a chance with copyright, either know that that song is not copyright or your best bet is just play music that doesn't have anyone singing at all. Just background music, that's it. The music that I've got in my playlist now, though, I know that none of it's copyright, so I'm good there. Uh, there's so much music that has been put on YouTube that you would think everyone would be getting strikes all the time. Yeah. I, I don't think I've ever... I think I did get one copyright strike once. But it didn't affect, it didn't affect my YouTube in any way. Is all it means is if you get copyright, is all it means is your adverts will not be basically on there. It would be someone else's adverts. Like the person who has the, the rights to that song, they can put adverts on that video. Even if you don't have monetization enabled, they can still put adverts on it. That sends you the name of the songs on Insta? <laughs> Probably not, man. <laughs> there is too many. There's too, too many. There's so many different names. I'm cranking the reel up a little bit more. This one pulled me out quite far. I like everybody on here as well. Everyone seems to always be quite chatty and always say hello. Everyone always seems to be friendly. I haven't come across anyone who's kind of angry yet, but there's always a first. It's only a matter of time. I shouldn't have jinxed it. <laughs> Gotta be careful that this one don't turn around and run. I, I've got a feeling it is going to. Thirty feet. Uh, I don't think it's gonna. Oh, we got it. There we go. I'm guessing the strikes only mean if the channel is making money, then it would be more serious. Mm, yeah, possibly in that kind of sense, it could do. Yeah. Become a member. Click here. Thank you, Nightbot. <laughs> I would play the game you like to play. I'm looking forward to the the next one because they've got. They got the Ultimate Simulator 2 coming. It doesn't actually say a release date yet though, which is a shame. I am interested in getting that though, just because of how good this one is. Have you played the new Thailand map? No, I haven't, no. I did think about buying some DLCs for it though. Because there is some maps that actually do look really good, don't they? And the DLCs are not actually too expensive. Which is good. I think the DLCs are only anything between like £4 and up to about £8, I think. I don't think they're more than that. I didn't look how much the new one costs, though. But 
obviously the newer ones could be a little bit more expensive possibly we got a Marlin coming in is he gonna have that he is having it I can't believe how many Marlin we have caught I thought that one the other rub was going as well but it weren't it's been very successful it's good when it goes like this it believe me it doesn't always sometimes it can take a short minute I play at least six different games on my channel I, I'm going to try taking up the 75. I don't know if that's a good idea. Oh, wow, that's close. I think 75 is too much. I'm going to have to leave it at 62. I'll try one more time. I guess it's okay. Starting to slow it down. Oh, wow, that was so close. Almost broke line. There we go. We turned it around. Oh, man. I didn't bring any water with me. I didn't think about that. That looked pretty cool. It's going to run. Wow. I'm very surprised it didn't break there. It's crazy how close you get them in. And all of a sudden, it's like they, they kind of chill and swim with you. And as soon as you get it close, they just, they turn around and just shoot off like a rocket. I shouldn't sing. <laughs> I shouldn't sing. <laughs> Oh well. All right, so three hundred, uh, four hundred and eighty-one XP. Well, then we're gonna get ninety-six for releasing it. Where's my mouse cursor? There. It's gonna release it. There you go. I don't know who this guy is, but he said hello. How am I doing? So I gotta be polite. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know who it is. I don't think I, I don't think I've ever ever seen his name before. But it could be because they got the YT there. That's normally the case. We'll wait again. The reflection of the water, it looks so realistic, it's unbelievable. I love that. It looks so realistic. It looks so good. I like that I can actually put a rod a rod out on a rod stand as well, I like that. I also saw in um, one of the other DLCs, you could actually, on one of the boats, it actually allows you to put three rods out, so... I think I think that that DLC I might end up getting that I probably might I might get it tomorrow possibly we'll see they didn't take it the Thailand map is beautiful a lot of coral reefs we played Pinus Bay at night the lights are beautiful yeah I have played there yeah I always skip through the time sometimes because it, even just skipping through the time, it looks so good. I'm very surprised on how good the picture quality is. When you leave the graphics on low on this game, it looks terrible. But if you crank the graphics up a little bit, it looks so nice. 
Can't complain either. I'm going to go getting all the big fish today. Nice catches. There we go. Is that another marlin? Yeah. I can... Well... Yeah, I can keep catching Marlin. Marlin is definitely going to be my quickest way to level up, I think. But I just need... I need that stronger rod. Yeah, I don't have any cash at the minute, but <clears throat> I'll have a bit of cash tomorrow. So tomorrow, wow. Tomorrow I might buy one of those DLCs. Uh, probably not, no. Unless the Ultimate Fishing Simulator 2 comes on there, then maybe, but... This one I'm not going to bother. It takes such a long time for me to get to the level that I'm at now, level 20. I don't know how many hours I've put into this game, but it, I know it is a good amount. It's obviously not as much as Fishing Planet, but i put a lot of hours into it. Yeah, I don't, I don't fancy... Um, I don't fancy starting it again from the beginning. Especially if, if the number two is going to be coming out soon. I'm pretty sure it's not going to allow me to transfer my account over. Which means that I'd have to start that again from the beginning as well. So I spend too much money on games sometimes, man. I get a little bit crazy. I spend too much money on games. Well, not on games. On the DLCs and the add-ons. That's what... That's where I keep spending too much money. How's it going, Kate? Good to see you, man. Yeah, I would have thought, yeah, on PS5, yeah. Don't, don't turn around and run. Oh, no, I think it's... Yeah, okay, we're good. Oh, that was only a small one. 72 pound. I'm going to leave it like that for one sec. I'm going to quickly get some water, guys. I need a drink. I forgot to bring my water. Give me one sec. Whoa, I, got, I forgot I got to sit down slowly. <laughs> I'll end up breaking my chair again for the second time. <sighs> oh, I got some Ribena. Do you know what? I was so nervous. We got just over 600, uh, about 700 XP for that. That's pretty good. Yeah, I was so nervous because after putting the glue on this chair, I thought, what if... What if I'm streaming <laughs> and one of the legs or one of the wheels break off again? If that happens again, I'm going to end up falling off my chair whilst being live. That would be that'd be quite embarrassing but funny at the same time. I don't know if you can see but it sits kind of at a slant now as well. It either sits to the right or... A little bit, a little bit too much to the to the left as well. It's, it feels better at leaning to the right a little bit though. Wow, that quick! I was just gonna, th I was just thinking, shall I, shall I move location? But I'm really surprised how many I've caught so far. Let's try 75. 
Give me at least 24 hours. I can't I can't leave it 24 hours, man. I'm streaming every day, aren't I? I don't have 24 hours to to let the glue dry. I think for this to dry, I left it around about what was it about? I think five hours or just over five hours, something like that. I put a bit of duct tape as well, the good old duct tape. <laughs> I put some duct tape around it. Gotta love the duct tape. This one looks strong. This one's definitely bigger than 70 pounds. For sure. It's taken line out so fast. It looks kind of thick as well, so. Ultimate Fishing Simulator 2 has a new developer, does it? I did, um. I've, I've seen some of the lakes they've got. I haven't seen any sea fishing on there yet. But that's probably going to be DLCs, I would have thought, or add-ons at a later point. <clears throat> I've clicked on to follow on Steam, so when that game does come out, I will find out. I'm looking forward to it. See what it's like. I mean, you can still use it, but the, the resin will be fully set after like a few days, really. Yeah, well, I put that on after putting it on. I left it. I left it about four or five hours. And then I put some duct tape on. And then I think I left it then for a further, not maybe like an hour. 900 foot out. If I don't start getting it back now, we're going to lose it. This is definitely a big marlin. I think the black marlin fight harder as well, so if this is black marlin, it would explain it. I'm surprised though, we're getting it back. We had 900 foot out, and now I got it to nearly 700 feet. It's actually quite intense, I've got to be honest. <laughs> you have to, you literally cannot take your eyes off that bar. I've got the vibration on the controller as well, that helps a lot. When I was using just the mouse and keyboard, I kept losing it quite a lot. But when you got the vibration on the controller, you know it's over halfway, so you have to look at it. So that's one good thing. Well, obviously, your mouse doesn't vibrate, so. After a few days, won't be able to break it. Even if you try really hard to. It's that strong. Yeah, I've never used it before. This is our first time. It seems like it's holding out though, so even though it, it, it is wobbly as, yeah, like really, really wobbly, <laughs> but it beats sitting on the floor, and if I fall off it whilst being on the stream, I guess it's just going to make everybody, just going to make everybody have a good giggle, isn't it? <laughs> I'd feel embarrassed, but it'd be funny though at the same time. There we go, we got it. Oh wow, there you go, that's my new biggest fish. Black marlin, 403 pounds. I said the biggest I can do is probably about 400. That's why I didn't put on the hash 12. That's why I'm using the hash 10 hook. Just because I don't want to catch anything too big because it's just going to be impossible for me to reel in with the gear that I've got. But look at that. What? 2,820 XP and 564. <laughs> And if I, if I lean to one side as well, don't laugh. See, one thing I could actually do as well, I'm going to look online, see if I can get one, see how much they are. But the, the chair itself is actually okay. It's not the most comf comfortable chair, but then... Like, it is okay, because I can have the back up straight. It doesn't recline. Like, if I push back, it doesn't recline. Um, 
So is all I actually technically need. The seat and everything, it's fine. Is you know the thing that it sits on, the the wheels and the, I don't know the proper term, the proper name for it, but. Um, I can't, I can't think of what to call it, but the legs, the legs and the feet, yeah. It sits into it, doesn't it? So that's technically the only thing I need to replace. Wow, we got another Marlin again. I cannot believe it. Marlin after Marlin, back to back. You gotta love it. This is some serious ultimate fishing. This really is ultimate fishing. This is crazy. Uh, it's, it's cool that we can catch some of those small small fish as well, but when you're catching fish 300 pound plus, that's a lot more bigger than compared to the other game. We normally catch in fish around about 200 pound. It would take me 25 minutes to reel in now, which is a little bit bonkers. Now, I know this probably takes me a good 10, 15 minutes possibly, but these fish are a lot lot bigger so more time bigger reward i don't know if it works the same as the other one where if you keep catching the same fish over time whether it gives you less money or less xp i don't know if that's a thing i don't i really don't know but because i'm so close to level 21 to buy everything all that is the best oh well almost lost it to buy everything that is the best you got to be level 21, so. And I'm nearly that. Once I hit level 21, from there on after, it doesn't really matter about XP, it's just the cash. Look at that, that guy just caught. 1,582 pound blue marlin. One and a half thousand pound, that is absolutely insane, man. How does he do that? We'll be like that. Once I get the other rods, though. Not yet. I paid about 250 for my chair. It has a massage and heat pads, but I can't remember the name of it. Yeah, I was thinking about getting... Um, they're called snuggle chairs. I was thinking about getting one of those, but... They're more like an armchair rather than an actual gaming chair, which I think... I know everybody, every streamer has gaming chairs, but I don't, I don't, I don't really, it really don't bother me about sitting in an armchair. I'm obviously going to look a little bit different to other people, but I'm cool with that. If it's going to make me feel comfortable and I can sit there for a, a good amount of hours gaming and not feel uncomfortable, then I don't mind, but yeah, that's 300 pound. That's a lot of money for a chair, man. It would pay for itself over time, but yeah. It's a lot of money. I thought it was going to turn around and run then, but it didn't. Look at that. 233 pounds. That's crazy. Look at the secret labs of... The secret labs range of gaming chairs. I don't... I think if I ever do buy another gaming chair, I'm not going to... I don't think I am going to buy another gaming chair, to be honest, man. I always, like, I have brought a couple of cheap gaming chairs over the years and they last forever. But every time I buy a gaming chair where I spend 100, 200 pounds, I don't know why, they just don't seem to last. Yeah, if I buy the cheaper chairs, they do. So, yeah, I don't think I'm going to bother. Once this chair is done, that's it. Well, it is done now, but... <laughs> Yeah, I could see how much the bottom part is for the legs thing. I could buy that and put that on for time being. And then eventually I will end up buying one of them other chairs. There's a big marlin out there. We got a fish on that rod. So I got some cut. Uh, whoa, whoa. I got some cut bait on this rod. And I'm only using a five hook on here, just because this rod is a, a weaker rod. I'm not going to get marlin. There is a good possibility I could catch marlin on that cut bait, but 
It says that I can, but in all honesty, I never have. It's going to be more of these rainbows than anything else, but it's still that extra little bit more X XP. It looks kind of nice as well. It's a shame that I can't change the camera angle any different other than that. I'd like to change the camera angle a little bit more. Oh, wrong button. Nobody saw that. Look at the size of that mile in there. I don't think I'd be able to bring that one in. That is an absolute tank. Uh, oh, he's turning around. He might go back for it. Do you know what the proper term, the proper name is for the um, the legs, feet thing for the chair is? You know, your chain, your your games, your, your gaming chair sits on sits on that wheel thing at the bottom. Do you know the proper name for it? Look at the size of that mile in there. That is absolutely insane how big that thing is. Cool, this one's running really well. Look at the size of that mile in. That is crazy. See, I don't have to keep it in this mode. I can really like this. It's just I change it to underwater because, it's, I don't know, I just feel like that. that's what you guys would like to see. <laughs> it could be wrong. Pedal stool? You think that that is what it could be called? Let me type it. Let me quickly search it. Let me see. No. No, nothing comes up for that. Well, stuff does come up for that, but not what I'm looking for. I'm going to change time early mornings this always seems to work best for these it looks so good the picture quality I love how good it looks that's what makes me want to buy the second one just because of how good the picture quality looks on this coming through into night oh my gosh look at that that looks insane man that looks so good Look at the reflection coming off the water. You cannot say it. that doesn't look realistic. There's no way in the world you could not say that don't look realistic. Oh, gaming chair replace replacements. I could check that. Oh, wow. There we go. We've got some interest in the night. I can't believe how many marlin we've caught. I've, ju I've just been so lucky through this stream. I really have been lucky. Look at that. It looks so good. Do you think the picture quality looks better on here compared to Fishing Planet? In my opinion, I definitely think it does. I mean, the picture quality on Fishing Planet is is really decent, but on here, the graphics definitely look a little bit different. I don't know why, but they just do look a little bit different. Cool, wow. This one's running really good. Four hundred foot.
I don't think I'm going to be able to get this one. I think this one's too big. The rod doesn't seem as detailed though with the spool and reel. Yeah, the the rods and reels don't look as great, I don't think here. Yeah. But the the surrounds the surrounding like the boats and the reflection that you get from the water is absolutely bonkers. The way you reel in is yeah, it looks kind of cranky, doesn't it? The way it reels in does look a little bit strange. <laughs> Yeah, the boat looks cool. I love the reflection of the water there. That looks so awesome. I love that. Sometimes I'm happy to just to play a game just because of how good the picture quality is. 228 pounds. Whoop. 228 pound Marlin. 1,700 and 11 XP 342 um, yeah I do yeah um, gaming chair replacement replacement base okay let me quickly search that yeah you do I think you do anyway I'm pretty sure you do I'll have a look Okay, so it shows the bracket. It shows the bracket. Can I just get any one, or is it gonna? Does it have to be a specific one? I'll leave that page up so I can look after the stream. <sighs> Which gaming chair do you have? Type in a replacement. Um, it's called GT Force. Yeah, I could do that. Uh, 2000 XP there. Um, I'm sure you can. Yeah, you can. I can't do it like that, though. Well, I can, but you guys ain't going to see it like that. But yeah, 4K and sev at 74 hertz. Underwater blur is off. Anti-analyzing blur halfway. Field of view, 72. Water reflections full. Yeah. I don't think though, even though it does look good. Oh wow, press the wrong button. Oh wow, still pressing the wrong button. Oh my gosh, I made it so small. I can't even see it. Oh gosh. There we go. Yeah, I need to put it on a different one. Just because me keeping it at that one. I don't want to stress my I don't want to stress my PC. Oh my gosh, I can't make the picture bigger now. Oh, Bubbles, what have you done? You should never do these things whilst live streaming. Alright, nobody saw that. Uh, Alright. I'm hoping if I stop it, run it, set it up again. <laughs> it should, um... This should take it back to normal, normal full HD, I think. Yeah, I probably could run it at 4K while streaming, but I don't want to. I don't want to 
force my force my PC too much. I need to look after it. The PCs cost too much money. Like 2400 FPS, there. That's crazy. There we go. Now I can actually see. There we go. Why does it put it back to 4K? Oh, yeah, because I didn't save it. What? When I put it at 10, 1080p, it gives me a smaller screen. Why does it do that? Mm. Is it on full screen? Okay, there, full screen. Oh, okay, I just changed it from that to Windows mode. What? <laughs> I gotta stop doing that. Now let me change it. Yeah. It goes to now small. I broke the game. Yeah, officially broke the game. Oh well. 4K it is. Yeah, that's the new the new map they brought. Shame it doesn't give you like a little preview of it though. Ultimate fishing, Greenland. I think that's the one that I saw. Yeah, I think that's the one. I think that was like two pounds something that DLC. I could buy that tomorrow though. Let me see how much it is. Hold on. Let me check. It will say two pound. Two pound sixty-seven. Pretty cheap. And then let's see how much this one is. The Thailand one. Thailand one costs three pound thirty-nine. Oh my gosh, man! That is so cheap. That is so so cheap. Yeah, that that's in cra crazy how cheap that is. But the boats look pretty cool on there though. Wow. I love the look of the boats. Oh, we might have to get that. We might have to get that. Alright, let's get fishing. We need some more XP. <clears throat> yeah, that's really good. That's really cheap. For both of them, I could buy both of them and... Yeah, it cost me about five, six pounds. I don't know if anybody else gets this, but every time I load in there, it always seems to come up saying not responded every single time. Look how beautiful this looks, though. It looks very nice. All right, let's change our rod. I don't know how to change the rod on the controller, so I have to do it on the keyboard. <laughs> I press certain things on the keyboard, certain things on the controller. There's so many different buttons for this game as well. The stream looks all off center now. What do you mean? All off center. Maybe I did something in this let me change that back to full screen. Is that better? No. I think it's probably because I took it into 4K. I think that's why. So 
So that at 50 hertz. Let me save that. That's normal size. Okay, 1080, 75. Save. There we go. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay, so is that better like that? There's something wrong with the video. Hmm. I shouldn't have changed anything, should I? <laughs> By changing things. That's how things go wrong. Water reflection. Where's, um... Controls, options. This is an options. So when I hit full screen... When I hit full screen like that... It goes big. That's fine now, but it's not fine when I take it bigger like this. Now it messed up again, yeah. Okay. Let me save that. Let me shut it down, I restart it again. It should be full screen though, because I put it as 1080. That's what it was at before. That's why you should never mess around with picture quality and graphics and that kind of thing whenever you're streaming. Whenever you're streaming, it's, uh, yeah. I did it before. When I, was, when I tried streaming at 4K, it makes my picture on the game smaller for some reason. Like, it's okay for me. I can see it in 4K at full size. But for some reason, you guys can't. Whoa. Okay, so does it look alright now? <clears throat> okay, so we're back to normal. Yeah, I'm definitely going to buy them. It is back to normal now. Perfect. Yeah, I am definitely going to buy them DLCs. For the price of £6. More new content. And it gives me somewhere else to fish. It's definitely worth it. Um, okay. What? Oh, right. That's why. I'm getting a little confused. Is it going to cast out? Why is it not now? Now it's not letting me cast. What is going on? The effect in the beginning when it's starting up is so... Yeah, yeah, it does look really nice, man. Look at the effect there of the water. I don't know why I can't cast now. It's bugged out. Okay, let me try... I think it's because I clicked down on the analog. I've got it on. Oh, there we go. I can't explain what was going on there. I have no idea. That was kind of strange, but hey, it's working now. <laughs> that was really weird. I don't know. No, it was just glitching, man, I think. I think it was glitching. It was going, yeah, it was going strange. Okay, they're all... There's one over that way. None around this way. Alright, let's move the boat a little bit. Oh, I think we got one coming in. I think he's coming for it. Is he? Yeah, he is. He's there. He is there, isn't he? Why is the rod not moving? I don't know what's going on with this game at the minute.
We are getting so close to level 21 though. I love that. If we're lucky, we might be able to hit level 21. And then I can buy the um, can buy those rods in this stream, possibly. Is that coming from my bait? It looks like it is. Is it coming for it? Yeah, it is. Right, here we go. This is the first mahi I think that we've, we're going to be showing. Apparently really good tasting fish. I've never tried, but so I hear. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, wow. Just turned around and darted off at the last bit. That's why it's always a good idea to keep your finger on the reel to make the drag weaker. Mahi, mahi, 18 pound. That's not too bad. It's night time for him. Look how beautiful it looks. I just, I, it, I love it when it's like that. As I said, sometimes I would just play a game. Even if I'm not really interested in that game, I could just happily play it just for the fact of how good the graphics look. Now, I generally do like playing this game anyway, just because there is some big, massive monster fish you can catch in this game, which is quite big fish compared to some other fishing games that I played, but the graphics really just make it that a little bit more sweeter. Now, let's troll around. quite a few up this way I think he's coming for it is he coming for it I don't know is he coming for it I can't uh, yeah he's, he's coming for it there we go No, never rainbow. <coughs> oh, what's this I see? How's it going, Amiga? Good to see you, man. <laughs> this is Ultimate Fishing Simulator. The graphics look <coughs> pretty decent. It does look really good. Take that reel down. That reel's at 86%. That 280, 268 XP and 53 cash. It's not too bad. Considering it's only a 33 pound fish, we can get 233 cash for it. But obviously, I'm just going to keep releasing. We want to get that better rod. The more I keep releasing it, the quicker we'll get the XP, the quicker we'll level up. Looks fun, looks better than Fishing Planet. <laughs> the graphics are really good, man. Graphics are really good. They're meant to be bringing out um, Ultimate F Simulator, Ultimate Fishing Simulator 2 as well. It hasn't There isn't a release date of it yet, but that is meant to be coming out. So I would definitely be getting that. Oh, I think we got Marlin on. No, we ain't. Yeah, it is on PS4, yeah. Some people said, though, that it was on PS4, but they took it out of the store. So I don't know if it's still there. I haven't checked. 
but I know the Ultimate Fishing Simulator 2 definitely is going to be as well though. So if this one isn't, the Ultimate, the, the second one of this will be. And it does look pretty good. They've got a lot of DLCs for this game as well. I don't have the cash for it just right this minute, but I'll have a bit of cash tomorrow. So tomorrow, I'm probably going to buy the the new DLC that they dropped, which the, the last one was in Thailand. Fishing in Thailand, and they got different boats and stuff, so I might, well, I'm not might, I probably am going to end up buying that and uh, showing a stream on that. There's some interest there. I see some movement. Oh, I think there is. Yeah, there we go. Look how beautiful. I hope it looks as good for you as what it does me. The controller is probably recommended for this game. It definitely makes it a lot easier. You probably, well, I say controller. I'm going between controller and keyboard. But the controller to reel the fish in when you've got a big fish on is definitely, definitely easier. That's for sure. Another mahi. We need some of those big marlin again. Get some of that XP quicker. It's cool to catch those fish, but... Yeah, the XP isn't isn't nowhere near the same, is it? Is that going for my bait? No. There's a lot, a lot of fish around this area, though. Like an insane amount of fish around here. Look at that on the left. It's literally... Let me just adjust my face cam uh, really quick. Because you can't quite see it. Um... Cam, let me just take it down a little bit. There we go, like that. All right, hold on. Let me see. Let me see if that's better. Uh, okay, resume. Then that way you should be able to see the the radar there because my my face cam was in the way. There you go, now you can see it. That's a bit better. We've got a fish on. I'm kind of looking forward to, to that tomorrow. Getting that Thailand DLC. Because it's new, I'm pretty sure it's going to look just as good as how... How nice this looks. There is different places though. Like this place looks. The graphics are pretty decent on here. I'd probably rate it about 9 out of 10. That's how good it is. Apart from. The thing that probably would make it 10 out of 10. Is the rod. The effects of the rods are not. They could be a little bit better. They could be a bit. But on the other hand. When you go into Piner's Bay. Uh, no not Piner's Bay. What is it called? Um, no, it ain't called Piner's Bay, I forgot the name of it now. But it was the when we last did a stream with Catching Carp, the graphics in that place look insanely good. I was so surprised how good it looked. And that wasn't, that wasn't a very high level to get to that place either, so. Even some, other, some lakes look better than others. Same goes that Thailand one. I'm pretty sure that's going to look decent. But the fact it's new, it's got to look decent, hasn't it? Wow, this one's running really fast. It doesn't want to slow down at all. See, once they get to, to level 21, we're by two new rods. If we can, if not, we buy at least one new rod. 
Then we can put on a hash 12. Then we can put on the the live bait. New line. We should be good to catch some of those big fish like a thousand pound. But until we get that bigger, that better rod, there's not much I can do. We just have to keep chipping away at these little small ones. Well, I say small ones. 400 pound fish is not small, but it, they are small compared to what you can catch. I did reel it back in a little bit there. At this point, I'm kind of fighting it. He's getting a bit. I'm getting a bit. Hold on. Oh no, we're getting it back now. My controller, at this point, vibrates like absolute crazy. But the more the bar moves up to the right there, to the red, that's when the controller, it vibrates like even more madness. Which is good, because if I took my eye off it for a second to read chat, and it started vibrating like absolute bunkers, I would know that that bar is up high. Hundred foot in. I've got a feeling this one's going to turn around and snap off. Well, not snap as in line snap, but I meant run away. But it didn't, so that was good. One thousand six hundred and eighty-nine XP, three hundred and thirty-eight cash. And then look how much we could sell it for. One thousand one hundred and thirty-nine cash. That's that's really good. But obviously, XP is what we want. I just, I just, it's kind of strange when you go from playing one fishing game all the time, the same one, and then you then play a different one, everything just seems very different. Clearly it is different because it's not the same game, but it does seem very, very different. Not in a bad way though, so that's good. Look at that marlin there, that one's massive. Fish on again. I love that we can troll like that and get fish. That's that's pretty fun as well. <laughs> I just love keep looking into where the direction of the sun is. The reflection of the water. I'm graphics mad. That's, that's my problem. I'm too much into graphics. Oh, look at that marlin there. That's a big one. How's it going, Gary? Good to see you, man. Uh, is this game any good? Yeah, I, I, I used to play it a lot back in the day. I did used to play it quite a bit, and then I ended up changing, started playing more Fishing Planet. And then obviously the update they did for Fishing Planet, I weren't too happy about it, so I've stopped playing it. And um, started playing this one. Now, I haven't quit on Fishing Planet. I haven't quit it, but... I just I just felt like I needed a break it was frustrating me it was annoying me and it wasn't it wasn't like I was enjoying it since that update where the fish just keeps on running and you're fighting it for like 25 minutes even on this game I can catch I can catch these fish like 400 pound fish they can catch they go right up to like one and a half thousand pounds it's insane but I can catch like 400 pound fish and it takes me around about five seven eight minutes to reel it in so it is a little bit of time consuming but obviously on fishing planet at the minute to reel in a fish that's 200 pound takes me takes me about 25 minutes man real time long time a little bit a little bit bizarre full of fishing but now you're playing fishing planet live um I might play it. I might play it at some point this week. Coming. I haven't. I, I. I've just given it a bit of a break for a little bit because it just, the update just just annoyed me. I know I've got to learn to adapt to it. You know, everybody, everybody themselves have got to put up with it. Not just. It's not just me, but it is frustrating. Uh, the graphics on this game though, I'm loving that. 
they got the ultimate uh, ultimate fishing simulator 2 coming out I'm interested I'm interested to see what that looks like I've seen a few pictures of it but we got some interest there Oh, is that Marlin going? Is it having it? Yes, beautiful. Whoa, 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 I almost lost that. <sighs> How's it going, PDS? Good to see you, man. It's annoying me too, Fishing Planet, the uh, the nerf system, yeah. That's why I had to give it a break, man. I can't, I can't make out that I'm okay with it, because I'm really not, but I kind of want to stop playing it because of how much it's annoyed me but everyone just keeps on asking me when I'm going to play it again so because of that it kind of pushes me towards playing it I am still going to play it but if they don't take the update back to how it was which I'm sure they ain't going to then I will still play it but I probably ain't going to play it as much as what I normally would I'm going to start playing other fishing games I still will play it and show updates on that game and that kind of thing but yeah, I'm going to start playing other fishing games more because it's just, it's too much of a grind for me, man. Me live streaming every day plus putting out videos every day. And then them making the grind even harder and longer for people like myself who stream that. They're just not interested and they don't care about my opinion in any sort of way. When I actually sent them a message, they even said to me, they don't know what I'm talking about. And I said, the app patch update freeze... 3.7.2 the real drag the fish can run off that's the up that's that update where you added that in where the fish can run off they said they don't know what I'm talking about whether they I don't know I can't explain why they don't understand what I'm going on about they added that into their update but yeah I don't want to I try not to talk about it too much because it does even just talking about it annoys me it really does been having a break from Fishing Planet, so don't know about new new update. It's terrible, man. The update still hasn't come out on the consoles yet. But when it comes out on the consoles, I'm pretty sure that a lot more people are going to be more annoyed then. But if you're on console, I'd make the most of it because how long it takes to bring in one fish is absolutely bonkers. It's a bit silly. It's a game and it's not real fishing. Well, that was my point that I kept trying to make to everybody. I was trying to say to... That's why I made a separate video saying about the update is... The update is not very good and... I'd say it's probably about 50-50. Half... Some... About half people agreed with me saying the update sucked. The other half said that I didn't know how to play fishing games properly and I sucked at that game. That's why I'm complaining about it. <laughs> but... As I said, if I'm live streaming every day and I'm making videos as well every day, d doing both of those, it's it's very hard for me to keep making new content on a certain game if they're going to make that grind near near fact impossible. Yeah, it's not easy. So, I will still play Fishing Planet, but if they don't change it back to how it was, just not as much. I'm going to be playing other fishing games. I'm lo I'm quite enjoying this game, and there's a DLC that I can buy for this game, a new one that came out recently. I don't have the cash right now, but tomorrow, tomorrow I probably will buy that DLC and show that. <clears throat> yeah, then Ultimate Fishing Simulator 2 is going to be awesome. I haven't seen too much on it, but what I've seen of it does look really good. I've been having a break, uh, break from Fishing Planet. Oh yeah, okay, I read that. It's a game, not real life. It's not fun now. You lose more fish than you catch. Also, the grind. Yeah. Like, I don't mind losing the fish, because I used to lose the fish before, but the grind is what makes it terrible, man. The grind is so ridiculous how long it takes. It's not it's not enjoyable like that. See, like, that one took me a little bit of time. I wouldn't say it would have took me as long as if I was playing Fish and Planet catching Arapaima. There's no way it took as long as that. And this one is a lot, lot bigger. 310 pounds. And you get a lot more cash and a lot more XP for this compared to compared to that what you would normally get. I'm currently playing Far Cry, New Dawn at the moment. I don't think I played that one. Good game. Ultimate Fishing Simulator 2. Crime's also out soon. Alright, so 
2254 XP and then we get 451 for releasing it cash 1339 again I'm gonna release it because I just want to get to level 21 as soon as we get to level 21 I can buy the best rod and rod the graphics on this game though to fishing planet 110% is better the real mechanics um, and the rods on Fishing Planet, I'd probably say look better. I like the way they work better. But if I had a choice between the way the reel and rod works in Fishing Planet compared to graphics, I would choose graphics every time. But yeah, maybe not so because <laughs> how much I've played Fishing Planet compared to this. Fishing Planet, I've played a lot more. I just feel like that that's quite a popular game people really did like that but just because that game's messed up a little bit with the update it doesn't mean that I can't play other fishing games so <clears throat> there's many many different fishing games there's a couple of good good ones I've played and there's a couple that ain't too great but sometimes they can bring out a fishing game and it's not too good and then they can then end up adding updates to that game and then it becomes a lot better so it's always worth sometimes when you buy a game if it's bad at the beginning it's worth going back to it sometimes because when those new updates come out sometimes they can make them better and like that netting you can do that yourself manually or you can have it on automatic like, like I have I wouldn't recommend manual it's hard work <laughs> it is really hard work trying to get a fish in the net so I leave that on automatic I need to do co-op, but none none of my friends uh, have that game. Have what game? Oh, Far Cry you is on about. Okay, yeah. Is that again? Got interest? No, it's just the waves. look at it like that that's crazy I hope it as I said I hope it does look as good for you as what it does me I, it probably doesn't because there's only a certain amount of picture quality you can you can live stream to YouTube so but it, it looks absolutely amazing for me but hopefully it still looks pretty good This is Mahi. They fight quite well. They're not very big fish, but they do fight really well, though. Look at that. Wow, this one's really going for it. 200 foot. That pulled me out 200 foot. I think like this the graphics look amazing like I would give that 10 out of 10 for the reflections but when you look at it like this and you see the fish near the top of the water and it moves around and the water splashes yeah that don't look too good <laughs> like that there you see the water splashing it don't the graphics there don't look too great they could have done a little bit better but apart from that though apart from that it's all good Oh, I pressed the wrong button. That's another thing as well. You don't have to always take ages to reel your fish in. You cast your rod out, it's not in the right place. You can hit B on your controller or hit Q on your on your keyboard. And it pulls your line in straight away. Which is good. I like that. I sound like I heard a gust of wind there. That's pretty cool. And we can also troll as well, which works amazing. So let's just move around a little bit. There is a lot of fish there, though. Let me go back into hunting mode again quick. I 
Is it raining? Yeah, it's raining. I thought I kept hearing a strange noise. The rain. That wind's got up a little bit. A little bit. Wow, it's like 30 mile an hour wind. Whoa. It's like 30 mile an hour wind there. Oh, is he going for it? That is massive if he, if he is. Oh my gosh. I don't think I'm going to be able to reel that one in. I'll definitely try. That is a, that is a really big fish. Look at that. 150 foot out already. <clears throat> now 250 foot I know when I get close to around about 900 feet that's when I kind of lose hope because I know not 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 too much after 900 foot that's it that it's going to end up despooling that's why I want to that's why I want to hit level 21 so I can stop that from happening at this level, me going for for these marlin is always a risk. The chances are more that I'm going to lose it, just because of how deep it's going. It keeps look at that. It keeps trying to go real deep down. Come on. I know when I get the other rods and the other reels and the line, stronger, all stronger gear, <coughs> I can then go bigger hooker then, go for even bigger fish. Fish the size of this, there's not a, the possibilities of me getting it is kind of low. It's not backing down. I know when it's more than f a 400 pound fish because it despawns, I can't stop it. So, uh, if I get it past, if I get it, yeah, if it despawns, then I know that it was more than 400 pound. I can't, I can't really do more than 400 pound fish until I get the better gear. 800, 800 foot out, still going. Oh, hold on, he's turning a little bit. Oh, I'm getting him back. He's coming back. Yeah, we're getting him back now. I still reckon it's close to 400 pound, though. If not, it's going to be like 300 and something pound fish. It's definitely going to be a big fish. For sure. 600 foot out. And that got us to nearly 900 feet. That's crazy. Look at that. What do you prefer? Do you prefer to see it like that? Or do you prefer to see the fish under the water? I kind of like both. I like that because of how nice that looks, the reflections, but I also like it like that so I can actually see the fish. I can't make up my mind what I like better though. Both is cool to be honest. I didn't think you was there, Trippy. I thought you left, man. You went so quiet. <laughs> That is, that is a big fish. Please don't run. Wow. I said like 300 and something or 400 pound. 394 pound. That is crazy, man. That's nearly 11 foot in, in, in height. That's crazy. 2,762 XP. 
one and a half thousand cash and 552 extra XP for release. Away you go. I'm, I'm surprised we managed to hold that one. I didn't think I was going to bring that one in. It's nice when you do though. It is really nice when you do. I think I should change the time a little bit. Let's just scroll through. I love the night time as well. The night time is awesome. Let's see if there's much fish around though. Oh wow. There's not there's a couple, but there's not there's a lot of small ones over there. There's probably one good size one there. Really hard for me to see the float though. I can't even see that float, but I know this one's gone. I saw the rod move. I think that's probably the only thing I haven't really done much on this game. Is the night fishing. I haven't done much of that at all. Yeah, I can see that float, but I can't see the other float for that rod. There might even be nighttime floats, I would have thought. Let me have a look, actually, real quick. Floats. Hmm. Maybe not. Maybe that might be though, because it's kind of bright. You should be able to see it. I thought one of them would have said night float or something, but yeah, there isn't. <clears throat> Come on. Hunting mode. Come on. There we go. Now let's change time. Oh, okay. I can't change time whilst we're in the hunting mode. Gotta wait for that. But we got a fish on anyway. Well, that's a good way to catch a lot of small fish. You can definitely catch a lot of small ones in the night time. Never mahi. Whoa. So yeah, tomorrow, I might stream this tomorrow, and then I might buy both of them DLCs. It's only going to cost me £6. I'll have £6 tomorrow. But I might buy the, the Thailand one first, just because that's the newest one. I feel like that is probably what people would want to see. Right, let's jump forward time again. I don't want to catch just small fish. I don't know why the rain looks a little bit better in the night time compared to the daytime. Look at that. Wow, that's really dark. That's kind of scary actually. I wouldn't like to be out on the boat when it's that dark. <laughs> oh well. Sun's up. Oh wow, look at that. No, let's go back to hunting mode, see if we see any around. Wow, there's an absolute beast over there. There isn't any near here though. Alright, uh, let's move the boat. See that big dot there? That That's how you can tell there's a really big fish there, but... When I have got the better rods, that's when I will definitely go towards those bigger dots. But at this point, there's no point. Is 
that one coming for it. I think it might be. Is it? I think it is. No, I think it's turned around. That is a big old fish there though. There's so many fish around here. And I think that one's coming from my line. Is it? No, it's not. There's a big one. Oh, wow. That is really big. That showed up on the... On that uh, tracker. That it was a really big fish. Like, proper big. Probably didn't want something as big as that. Look at the size of that one there. That's a pretty good size as well. That one. Oh, I'm not. I'm not going to get this one. There's no way. We haven't long got hooked up. I'm at like 350 foot out already. I'd be very surprised if I did. 400 foot out. This one is too big. 450. Wow. Yeah, I don't think. Hey, look at that. He's got so much strength in him still. I'm not getting this one. This one definitely does look bigger than 400 pound. That's 600 foot out. Six fifty, still going really fast. There's no way. Seven hundred foot. That's why I need to get them better rods. Let's take eight hundred foot. I physically cannot stop it. There's no way we're not getting that. Nine hundred foot. It's over. Nine ten. Nine twenty. It's gonna de spool. Nine thirty. Nine fifty. It's gonna de spool. We're not getting that. I didn't think I would, to be honest. Oh, I don't know. Oh, hold on. I'm getting it back a little. Yeah, I'm getting it back. Oh, my God. I don't ask me how. I was at 960 foot of line out. Oh, my jeez. I am very surprised I managed to make that turn. I did, really didn't think I would. Nine hundred and sixty foot. <laughs> wow. <clears throat> this has got to be bigger than four hundred pound, though. It's got to be, surely. I'm hoping it is, just because of the fact of getting more XP. It's taking a short minute to reel in as well. But it would do from 960 foot being out. We now got it just below 350. Still going. I just don't want it to run again. I really, really hope it doesn't run again. Looks like it's quite deep down as well still. Hundred and fifty foot. Nine 
nighty. I'm going to take the reel down a little bit just in case it does turn around and fly off. Oh, yes, we got it. Oh, wow, okay. Wasn't as big as what I thought, but it's still my new record for a strike marlin. Anyway, 327 pounds. I thought it was going to be stronger than that. I really did. That had such a crazy fight, that one. You can actually play this game in VR. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 2,356 XP. 1,433 cash. Release for 471 XP. So let's release. We are getting so close to... So close to level 21. I just really want those new rods. Then I can put on big ones. Which DLC did you want? Um, it was the Thailand one. And there was another one as well. What was the other one called? Well, they're quite cheap. The DLC was like... The Thailand one is £3.39. And then there was another DLC which was... Which was it? What was it called? Uh, called Greenlands. Was it Greenlands? Yeah, Greenland. Greenland. Greenland and um, the Thailand one. So it's about six pound. Bates. Um, I'm gonna need some more live bait. We've only got 14, and I think I needed some more large cut bait as well. Large cut bait. Oh, that's small cut bait. There you go, big cut bait. We only had 11 of that. It's pretty cheap though. Resume. There we go. Let's have a look. There's not much in the area. Alright, let's move around. There's one there. I'm just about to go over the top of it. Oh, there's quite a few there. Let's go slow. You troll it slowly. Oh, wow, that's a big one. That's a big marlin. That, yeah, I think that's striped marlin by the looks of it. That could be the same fish that we just literally put back in. <laughs> There's a possibility. I don't mind if it is. We still get a good amount of XP. It's just a matter of if I can stop it. So look at that. In, in, the, um, in the room that we're in. Like somebody's caught 1,149 pound fish, uh, blue marlin, somebody else caught a blue marlin, 1,000 pound, and then somebody else has caught one, 685, but I just need to, I just need to get them better rods, <clears throat> I am close to it, I just keep, if I keep catching these marlin like this and keep getting XP that fast, that will definitely... Yeah, sorry. <laughs> I was concentrating. Yeah, I would definitely I'd definitely be able to level up through the stream. Cool, wow. They fight so good. 700 foot, still going. Seven fifty. It's always a it's always a tough one when you get when you see it get past eight a hundred feet, eight hundred feet. I was gonna say foot feet. Yeah, when you get past eight hundred, you never know. That's when you know, there's a good possibility you could lose it. Kinda makes me more play nervously. Nine hundred foot going strong. This one is not. I'm not gonna be able to turn this one. There is no way. Nine sixty was the other one. This one's nine seventy. 980, 990, 
I'm not stopping this one. Thousand foot out, it's gone. <sighs> now you can see why I need the stronger rods. That's a shame. The DLC is on sale right now. Which one? What, the Thailand one or the the one with the boat? Oh, yeah. Minus 15. Yeah, minus 15%. The Thailand. £3.39 and then the other one was like £2, whatever it was. So, yeah. For two of them, that's pretty cheap, £6 for two. Uh, I can't believe I lost that. That's why I need to get bigger, stronger rods. Not bigger rods, stronger rods. Stronger line. I should be able to... Should be able to put more pressure on it. All of them, from what I see. Yeah, for all of them, I think it was around... You can buy it as a bundle. I think it's about twenty pound, something like that. Twenty pound something. <clears throat> Do you like this game? Then are you interested in it? I see a marlin there, but he ain't gonna come for it. Not on that side of the rod. There's cut bait on there. There's a small one. I think he might be interested in my cut bait. Let me have a look. I think he is. Is he? No, he swam straight past it. Oh, no, I think he's on it. Is he going on it? I think he is. Yeah, he is. Okay, there we go. <laughs> yeah, it's okay, but just a little slow for your liking, but that's fishing for you. Yeah. The pace isn't as quick as what I would like it to be, if I'm honest, but... You know. When you're catching big monster fish, like... You're trying to catch fish... 300 pounds right up to like one and a half thousand pounds you got to expect that is going to take time isn't it but i like that you control on it i really like that let me take the time forward a little bit get that sun in the air it just looks so different when you change the time Look at the waves. The waves are definitely a lot more. They're definitely a lot more higher now. Right, let's have a look. I think early morning works best for them, if I'm honest. I shouldn't have really jumped forward that time, but it's alright. We can keep jumping forward. The good thing is... Oh, wow. I went straight past it. Yeah, the good thing is, is it doesn't cost anything to change the time. I don't cost anything for me to keep fishing. Yeah, it doesn't cost me any any extra money or anything like that. I don't know why it's not letting me jump forward time. Is it because there's a fish on? Yeah, there's a fish on. This one's different. This That ain't mahi, definitely not. I don't think it's... Yeah. I was going to say, I didn't think it was rainbow either. Where's that float? Oh, it's there. Okay, let's take the time forward again. There you go. About 7 o'clock. From 7am always seems to be a good time for marlin. Not very many big fish around here though, so let's troll a little bit. No, oh, there is a couple actually there. That's alright. We're troll around. I 
can always do a 180 and come back on myself. I try not to go too fast because they just they just come up and just hit your line so quick. Oh boy, how's it going, Cookies? Good to see you again, man. I think I need to go forward, do a 180 turn around. There's a lot of fish around here, though. There we go. That's 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 pretty cool. I like that I can do that. There we go. Another marlin. It's not a striped marlin this time, I don't think. So. Hopefully we can get this one. You on your boats? You and your dad are fishing so far. Lo lots of catfish. Nice, man. You do a lot of fishing in real life, don't you? I noticed that you're always, you're always doing a lot of fishing. That's cool. Wow, this one's running hard. Oh no, it's gonna break. I had to back off on the reel there. If I didn't, it would have broke. Come on. You should you you should have seen some of the fish that we've caught in this stream so far, man. We've caught a lot of marlin, like some of them like 400 pounds, just under 400 pounds. Some massive fish in this place. I need to get one more level so I can get the better rods. Oh, there you go. I'm getting this one back. Pulled me out to nearly 600 foot. Nearly. Look at that. The reflection of the water. Absolutely love it. I don't know how many times I've said that, but I do. <laughs> I definitely do. Uh, I don't actually have Greenland. I am going to buy it tomorrow, though. I'm going to buy that, and I'm going to buy... Um, I'm going to buy the Thailand as well. Wow, that one was only tiny, man. 64 pound. 516 XP and 103 we released, so... Just over 600 XP. It's still, it's still alright. It didn't run that that far. That's probably why. That's probably why it wasn't very big. It would have ran a lot further if it was. On Xbox, Greenland ain't a DLC. Is this a different game? This is Ultimate Fishing Simulator. Yeah, you have to pay for the DLC. Of Greenland. That's what you have. <clears throat> yeah, I'm gonna. I am gonna buy that DLC. I'm gonna buy Greenland's DLC. Um, the new Thailand. I'm gonna buy that one as well. I'm gonna buy a few different DLCs for this. The Thailand one looks really nice, and the Greenland looks awesome. So I, want, I definitely want to try both of those. I 
I was going slow. I was hoping he was going to turn around. But he ain't interested. Right, let's go. I was going to say, let's go back the other way, but quite a lot just popped up there on the radar. Wow. There's a lot. Next DLC, Volcano Fishing. I like the look of Ultimate Fishing Simulator too. Have you seen that one yet? That one looks pretty good. Sorry about that. I was reading messages. It's kind of hard sometimes. See, people always seem to leave messages on my YouTube every single time when I'm streaming. All my phone always rings when I'm streaming. If I'm not doing nothing, nobody contacts me. It's like, it's like the game knows we got Marlin coming. I knew that was. I saw it running up. Imagine that though. <laughs> I like that he's got a lot of sea fishing. The, the thing is, there's probably more DLCs for this game than what there is actual free lakes. But in all honesty, the, the DLCs are pretty cheap. They don't cost too much. Like for the Greenland one, I think it was just under three pounds and then just under four pound for the the new one that's not long come out so they are pretty cheap oh actually do you know what oh wow I, I think I have like two pounds something on my steam account or four pounds two pound three pound four pounds something like that so I could have actually bought one of the DLCs now but there's not really much point in me buying it now just because I'll have to change the name of the stream title and YouTube don't really like it when you do that so I'll hold out till tomorrow now and show it tomorrow no, I'm getting it it's coming back no it's running again no, I'm getting it back now there you go. The controller it vibrates so much, and then when the when the intent like it's it's quite intense. It's like the vibration's really really strong, and then it kind of dims down a little bit. Then as it dims down, you know then that's when you're you're getting that fish back. But then every now and again, all of a sudden the vibration comes on really quick, which is when the fish turns around and tries and runs. I don't know how many people can actually fish in one place as well. I think the most I've had so far is about nine people in the same place. But I don't know how many you can have in one room. Is it classes of room? I think it is. I don't know. Alright, 70 foot. 50. Don't run. There we go. Uh, wasn't a very big one just under 78 pound but still the XP is what we're always after 618 XP plus 124 let's release that looks so much bigger there in the water you look at that there that looks a lot bigger than 78 pound Oh, there's another one over there as well. That looks so much bigger than 78 pound. Look at that. One there. There is a couple still around here. It looks like he's heading over that way. 
There you go. I knew he was. I can't believe how many marlin I've caught. I really can't believe it. The last time we come here and I did a stream, I tried and it didn't work out too well, so we ended up going to the other places. I think the one thing that has helped is going from the 76 pound line to now using the 88 pound line. That has helped a little bit. And instead of me trying to just reel him really fast, I kind of have to just keep on tapping the reel and wear it down. There's just no way you can force these in quick. Has to be slow. Come on. 350. Still swimming real strong. Four hundred foot. Look how much strength is in that tail. Crazy. Four fifty. I think I'm getting back a little bit. No. Kind of even at the minute. I get a little back, but he's pulling a bit at the same time. I kind of have him turning a little bit. So he is wearing out. 520 foot. Well, there we go, he's starting to turn now. Yeah, I'm getting him back now. I don't think that's, that's too big then. That's probably under 100 pounds. Still XP though. <clears throat> Let me plug my charger in for my music. I don't think that one's going to... I think that's just going to come in easy. Yeah, there we go. Oh, wow. I said uh, under 100 pounds. I would have never have thought that. 247 pounds. I would have never have thought that. That's crazy. 1,838 XP. We can release for 368. So let's do that. We are getting so close. That was a good sized fish. I know I really wouldn't have thought that was more than a hundred. I really wouldn't have done. There's a lot around here. There's a lot over there as well. There is so much. I think we got one coming in. There we go. That is crazy how quick it is. That's why, I, that's why I normally start at 7. I feel like 7 o'clock. Just, you just get hit after hit. Now you can catch pretty quick, but from 7 o'clock, it works amazing. I think maybe another, I don't know, maybe four or five really good sized fish. That would probably make us level up. Could be less than that, depending on the size of the fish. It's got me out to 350 foot so far. Now 400 foot. 
Oh wow. Uh, almost had to oh I might have to back off on the rule in a minute. This one's showing no signs of slowing down. <laughs> Five hundred feet out. Still swimming strong. Oh wow. I can hardly reel. Let's get into the red so quick. I think I'm I'm fighting it. I think it's turning. There we go. Yeah, we get we're getting it back now. Quite a bit there. The reel just kept on vibrating so much. The reel, the uh, controller, just kept vibrating so much. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why. Maybe it was still trying to fight against it. Look at that one up there as well. That's a big one up there. There are so many of them around. Wow, 277. Nobody saw that. 277 pound that one. That's a good size. 2000 XP, 400 to be released. Let's release. That's awesome. So there's one over there, there's one there, there's one there, so there's three around. Oh, there's quite a few there as well. I don't know if there's marlin there, we've got to wait for a minute. We've got to wait for that fish hunter to come back up. Come on. There's a big one there. No, they don't look like it. I don't know. Some of them are, though, over that way. To the right. It's a rainbow. <clears throat> these ones even though they're only small they're still nice to catch them just makes you know that you're getting that bit closer saw that there's only one in the area now I probably am better off moving there's quite a few there there's quite a few wow there's a lot of fish around here like an insane amount Is that one coming? No. I 
Is he going for it? I think he is. I know we got one on there, but I was keeping my eye on the Marlin one. Some big raider spots there too, yeah. It is pretty good. I like how it is quite accurate, that fish finder. It is very accurate. Mahi. It's kind of cranky when you move around. <laughs> I like when you go like that, look. That looks kind of... Looks like it's a little bit too much in your face. Another 200 XP though. I need to find something to put under the chair that side. <clears throat> I don't know what. <laughs> I need to put something so it doesn't keep leaning that way. A lot of mahi around here. I don't think they're touched the live bait. I think that what I think that's going for it though. Oh wow, that made me jump. Oh, there's a big fella. That did make me jump. Like the fish cam too. It's nice, isn't it, to see something different? Like I know it's still a fishing game, <laughs> but it's still it's still good to show something different. All look like green aliens swimming around. <laughs> it's good when you troll on the boat. You just see the green dots. And then when someone when one of the fish hit either one of your baits, it then lights up red to show you that a fish is on, which is good. Because you can't hear it. It's good that it lights up like that. Oh! <laughs> I'm not going to say anything. Nobody saw that. I'm not going to say anything. I'm surprised I haven't lost more fish than that, though. I, I really am. In all honesty. I am quite surprised I haven't lost more. It is a little bit of a struggle with the line and rod that I'm using. Now, let's pick up some speed and then we'll turn around. There's just fish absolutely everywhere. There's one there near my line. There we go. Is that on that one? No, it's on that one. It looks pretty cool when you hold the rod up higher. You see the bend in it. That looks a bit better. Rather than keeping it straight like that. Another mahi. 
Well, that's proper in your face. <laughs> wow, okay. That's, yeah. Not very big, only 23 pound, but again, still another 200 XP, which helps us get that a little bit closer. This is a glitch that I've noticed for this as well. So I cast, watch, it just keeps doing that. So I change rod and I go back to that rod, and then that normally fixes it. There you go, you see? It's strange. Don't know why it does that. It's kind of weird. It's kind of strange that it does that. Marlin. I literally didn't even need to hardly troll anywhere there. Oh wow, almost lost that. Take it up more, Let's see. Yeah, that's all right. <clears throat> Running strong, this one, though. Oh, wow. Uh, I lost the I lost the fish for you, B. I was looking at my dog. It's an excuse, but it's a true excuse. It's actually a good excuse. That was true. That was real. I think, is that fish trying to catch up? Hold on. I think it was. It was swimming my way, then it kind of backed off. Maybe I was going too quick. Look, see that one? There you go, it got it that time. Couldn't resist that bait. Well, had no fight at all. And then that last little bit, it woke up. There we go. Free Amber Jack. Nearly 250 XP. I didn't look to see how big it was. It wasn't very big. that one coming for it? No, it backed off. Uh, you don't have to repair it, man. Which is good. It says how much durability it is. And it shows how much durability it is. <laughs> Shows how much durability is for the rod, line, and reel. But you don't ever have to repair it, though. So, yeah, it's pretty cool.
I was thinking maybe that one there was going to be interested, but he, he weren't. He swam straight past it. That one isn't either. Oh, hold on, actually. Is he coming back for it? It looked like he was. He's changed direction now. Well, big fish there up ahead. Only the one. But the one big one. On his own. I want to see if I can see that. There it is. Can't see where that. Fl oh, my other floats there. There's another one there. Well, it did show it. Oh, there you go. Now it's appeared. It disappeared, didn't it come back? The notifications on my phone right now is going absolutely bonkers. What's going on? I think he's going to hit that. He's going to hit it. Looks like he keeps trying to come back for it. Let me stop for a minute. Let me just have a quick look at my phone. Got to quickly reply to this. No, we're good. Never rainbow. Two night EXP plus fifty eight if we release. I don't know how much those rods are actually. That's one thing I should do really. I should really check. Hold on, give me one sec. I'm just gotta refresh, I got a buffer. For some reason. And there we go. Nothing in the air. Let me change the time. Seems okay here. Yeah, I think it's just my internet. I come up saying connection, connection is low. Okay, six thirty. 
couple there. They're the only two in the area, though. Is he coming this way? He's coming this way a little bit. We do one hunter mode one more time. If he isn't close to my beta, then we're we we'll keep trolling. That seems like the be to be the best way to do it. Oh, there you go. There's another one that's just appeared. There's a few there. No, let's just move. There's quite a few up this way. Is he coming for it? I think he is. Hold on. It looks like he's swimming towards it. No, he isn't. I really don't know. Is he or not? He's now swimming away. He did swim towards me. I think he was going to go for that, to be honest. I think I was just moving too quick. It did look like he wanted it. Wow, look how many. There was a lot. It's good when you get a bunch of them together like that. It's just a pain when there's quite a few of them, but they're spread it out. Just want to get past that big one there. There we go. I think we got one coming. Yeah, we got one. He come from really far out, that one. He really wanted that. He really wanted it. This one's fighting hard. <clears throat> yeah, I got the real. At 75. Sometimes I have to back it off down at 62. So I think once I buy the better rod and the better reel with the stronger line, I might even be able to take it up to like 88, possibly. And if I could, that's obviously just going to make my process even quicker. And it means that I obviously ain't going to lose as many big fish, which is the the main goal that we're trying to go for. This one's going strong though. 400 foot out so far. Wow. 500 foot. Looks like I'm getting it to turn a little bit then. No, right, still going. Is it turning? I think I am. Yeah, I think I'm starting to get it to turn. No, nope, it's going again. We're at 590 feet out. There you go, he's starting to turn. vibration stop now I can when it stops I can take the real speed up to a hundred just when I when I get in close obviously I'll take it down again just so that way it doesn't end up going crazy 
I don't want to lose it. So we was about halfway through level 20 and we're still not quite level 21 and we've been streaming for nearly three hours and we've had a lot of fish as well now we've caught a lot of fish this stream and we're still not level 21 crazy anyway 245 pound good size 1828 blue marlin release for 365 XP I was thinking maybe like four, maybe five more of those would be good. But how wrong I was. <laughs> how wrong I was. I think we got some interest there, haven't we? I don't know. Do we? Doesn't look like it. No. The float kept moving around. That was that was strange. Right, waiting for hunting mode. There we go. Okay, let's move around a bit again. There's a lot around here. There's a lot of fish, but a lot of them... A lot of them are mahi or the uh, amber jack. Oh, we got marlin coming in fast. Really fast. At least I know I can start from 6.30 now rather than 7. Because normally I start from 7. It seems that 6.30 we're, we're pulling him in pretty quick as well. So it means I can start from maybe even 6. I could probably try that. Starting from 6 a.m. The early morning seems to work so well. Three hundred feet already. I thought it was gonna break off. Then I was drinking my drink and I see it lit up red. <laughs> I couldn't hit the other button to release the reel, the uh, reel. I thought it was gone. Come on, slow down. 450. Still going. I think when I get them better rods, these little ones, well, they're not even little, but these ones, I feel like they're going to be a lot easier to reel in. So in, in some of the places that you fish, you can actually see the ocean, um, the ocean, the, uh, not the ocean, well you can, the ocean, in some shallow places, you can see the floor, but when you're fishing in lakes as well, obviously you can see the floor, but here, because it's so deep, it just gets darker and darker and darker as the fish goes down, I've never seen the floor in this place, but when I get a bigger, the bigger rod, we catch bigger fish they are gonna fight and swim longer so it is possible that we could end up seeing it at some point yeah there is isn't there there is loads of good music that I'd love to listen to that's why I just put this music on it's just it's better than it's better than nothing that's the way I look at it Just a little bit of background music. But yeah, there's definitely a lot better. <laughs> For sure, a lot better music I, I could be listening to than compared to what this is. Yeah.
<laughs> Do you know what? When it comes to certain songs and stuff, I don't always know the name of the people that sing it. Unless it's a really, really good tune that I really like and I've listened to it a few times and then, and then I do, but otherwise, yeah, I don't always know too many names for songs, but when it comes on, I sure know if I know it or not. Okay, nearly 2,000 XP, 267 pound, and 395 for releasing. Keep trolling. There's a lot of fish around, man. A lot of marlin. I'm going to start from 6 a.m. in future. There are so many around. And it looks like we got one coming in hot. Hold on. Is he coming in for it? They look like they're all swamping. They're all coming in. They all. They. Uh, I think they all wanted some. Whoa. Yeah. Well, that glitch. I'm glad that happened because that hasn't happened before. Well, it has, but not when I'm streaming. <laughs> he kind of spins around in a circle with a net. That can happen quite a bit. How do you go? String is one of my favourites. Mix my, mixed my DJ. Let's keep trolling. There is a lot of fish here. See, I could go to the. I could wait for them to come to me, but I'd rather go to them because it's just quicker. And I think we got one coming for this one. Yeah. Oh, wow. Mahi. Fighting crazy, though. If you move your rod around too much, left or right, look, makes it go into the red bar to automatically ready to snap. Got to be very careful with it. Can't move it too much at all. There we go. 21 pound mahi. Number 200 XP. I really should look to see how much the let me see how much the rods cost because otherwise I'm gonna have to start selling some I'm gonna have to start selling some fish oh uh, yeah uh, okay well not too much 2300 uh, reels and 2000 they're pretty cheap they are pretty cheap. Line capacity 1,302. The one that I've got is 1,100. So that's an extra 300 on top. Okay. 
Well, I've probably got enough to buy two rods and two reels and more lines, so we're good there. your favorite type of music mine is like trance I, I like trance Ibiza scenes without all the crowds I hate the crowds um, yeah I like trance I like I like some of drum and bass I don't mind that too much um, like I like Eminem as well Eminem is pretty cool Yeah, trance music, Eminem. Um, some rap music's okay. I don't mind some rap music. Um, a lot of my family listen to a lot of reggae music. So, uh, yeah, <laughs> because they listen to it so much makes me like it. I like, I like reggae music as well. I think we got one coming in. Let me see. I think that one's coming for it. Is he coming? No, he isn't. My phone's getting crazy. There you go. Sorry about that, man. <clears throat> no more text, and then my phone goes ding again. It's always when I'm live streaming, man. I'm not even joking. I sit there and I do absolutely nothing. Not one person texts me. Nobody, nobody rings me. But as soon as I start a stream, or I am streaming, that's it. It's like people know that I'm streaming, so they're going to ring me just because of that reason. One of your favourites too. It's got all dark by me. Outside it's dark. Nine o'clock. 10 o'clock for you. Oh wow, there's a lot just in front. I was thinking about streaming more. No lie, I was. Because obviously the kids are going back to, to school. So instead of streaming once a day and doing one video, I thought about maybe streaming like sometime in the morning and then streaming maybe like after 6 p.m. in the UK time as well. So maybe like morning, I don't know, say like 11 a.m. Oh, that's a big, big marlin there. That is a big marlin. Yeah, I was thinking maybe like 11, 11 a.m. till maybe like 1, 2 p.m. And then maybe like 6 p.m. till around about 9, 10 p.m. I don't know. I just got to figure out different timings now. Yeah, I got to figure out different times because the kids are going back to school, picking them up from school, taking them and that. I got I got to have different timing. That's the other thing as well. Like, I, I wouldn't mind streaming even longer hours than what I do, and I wouldn't mind streaming twice a day. But 
I think I think it works better when I post out a video and do a stream because sometimes it's like some people don't some some people don't mind watching streams but they haven't always got the time to sit there and watch me stream a game for like three four hours or so whereas if me making videos like 15 20 minutes you know that's a lot less time that I have to watch it so I'm not sure whether I'm still gonna be streaming da daily but I'm not sure whether I'm gonna change it to two streams a day or just just keep doing what I'm doing just take the streams back a little bit later because it's normally like 2 to 2 30 p.m. UK time that I stream maybe take that back to around about to about 6 p.m. possibly and then bring a video earlier because normally I drop a video at 6 p.m. so I can turn it around around about 2 30 I could drop a video then around about 6 p.m. I could do a stream I think this one's gonna end up despooling can't stop it I did have that at 60 something though the real I only just noticed that I messed that up I should have put it at 70 straight away slow it down wear it out it's over it's over thousand feet it's over ah I messed that one up nobody saw that no one saw that I can't believe I did that I only noticed that the last bit there that it wasn't very yeah it wasn't very um, high the real I should have made the real more than 60 I could have stopped it if it wasn't too big but Oh, it looks like we've got Marlin coming in. Is he coming for that? It doesn't look like it. Ugh, early mornings. I don't mind getting up early morning, man. I don't mind it too much. Especially once your body gets into that certain routine of keep doing it, you know. Well, then it's okay. There we go. Fish on. Is it Marlin? It is. Again, I saw that. You love saying that. <laughs> Nobody saw that. I try. I try and make it funny. I try and throw it off so that way people don't talk about it. <laughs> Sometimes it works. Most of the time it don't. But it's cool. Two hundred foot out, and it's swimming like an absolute tank. Look how quick it's moving. What are you doing? My dog made a growling noise. You're a funny bro, you, cr <laughs> you crank me up on days. I feel I feel like eating the world. I don't I don't think you're the only one man. Sometimes people have bad days and me sitting here, me saying silly things, always keeping it family friendly. But saying silly things. By me saying those silly things, if it can make somebody giggle to themselves or sit there and smile knowing they were having a bit of a rubbish day or just weren't having a good day and then I can make them have a little giggle by saying silly things that makes my day but when I say having a giggle I don't mean my chair break and me fall off my chair and um, that be on a live stream <laughs> I don't mean in that way I don't want it to be funny to the point where it hurts Physically, anyway. Probably mentally in the long run. <laughs> uh. I 
80 foot. We're getting close. Oh, it's, I knew it was going to do that. That's why I backed the reel off big time. I had a feeling. Yeah, it's hard, man. You're not the only person, though. There's a lot of people that... Um, a lot of people have anger issues and trying to figure out the best way to to keep you calm and you know gaming really does help with with anger issues it really does help because you're not thinking about anything you're concentrating on the game trying to you know take your mind off certain things can help technically a bad day for me Car broke down, now gonna cost me X amount, but they, the bubbles was streaming, so it took my mind away from it. <laughs> That's it, man. That's it. I even do that myself. I'm no lie. Like I know I do it for some of you guys, and I do. It really does help some of you. But some there's some streamers that do it for me as well. Like sometimes I'm having a bit of a rubbish day, you know. And obviously I try not to talk about it because I don't want it to be too much drama I'll talk about that in one sec 1700 XP 30, 341 if we release 226 pound in weight and 1145 for selling we're gonna release again yeah so sometimes obviously as I said I don't I don't like to try and I don't want to make it drama and that kind of thing so I have bad days and sometimes when I have those bad days, me coming on, watching somebody else live stream, and then talking about all good, posi you know, all everything positive, just all good stuff that they talk about. Is that rod going or what? That's glitched out. Let me recast it. Yeah. Me watching other streamers, sometimes they give me good vibes, and um, by them giving me good vibes, it makes me feel better. And then, if they're not streaming and I still don't feel too good, I then start streaming myself. And then people come into the stream, and I get them hyped up for catching certain fish or showing new games. And people get hyped up because they see me get excited, or you know, just whatever it is. Or just for example, people coming in saying <coughs> that I made their day or I made them feel a little bit better. That can cheer me up sometimes. I wake up, I look at my phone, and I see nothing but just bad comments. So I have to obviously delete them because I'm family friendly. But because I'm deleting them, I'm then reading them, which I know they them people mean absolutely nothing to me. They're just keyboard warriors, I know that. But sometimes it does... Not all the time, depending on, on the day and how I am. But sometimes some of them bad messages that I read can really put me down. And then I start streaming. And then people start saying nice things. Makes me feel better. So it's not just me watching other people. But even even you guys yourself can... You can make me feel better. And then I make you feel better. It's kind of like, a, you know, we're helping each other out. We're family here. <laughs> and the worst part the worst part is, is <laughs> if I lose in a game I would get more mad yeah you gotta you gotta giggle to yourself when something happens like that that's what I try to do if I lose a fish or I'm trying to do something and it's kind of frustrating you gotta you gotta try and giggle to yourself I gotta admit yesterday when I was streaming um, Tony Hawks we was doing the career mode and I was I was so close to raging man I was so close to raging and Mahi 24 pound yeah I was I was I was quite irritated because I knew that I could do it but I just kept doing it wrong and it was just annoying me and I did get quite frustrated in the end it frustrated me that much I ended up because um, Big Man was watching me on share play. In the end, I ended up giving him the controller and let him play for a little bit. 
until I chilled out. I had like a five minutes chill out just watching him. And then I started playing it again and that was cool. So yeah, some games sometimes can can uh, be a little bit of a pain. <laughs> Bubbles does say by day. The worst part is if I, oh yeah, okay, I read that. Which streamer do I watch the most? It would have to be TG, man. I love that guy. He's family friendly, which is what I am. He does rage, but not to the point where it's over the top. And he's funny. He's always positive. He, he, he has a good community. He gets a few people in his chat who do say some silly things. A lot of self-promoting and that kind of thing. But as a community, he has, he has a pretty decent community. And he, yeah, he's a really nice guy, man. I like him. It's okay. The starter motor got stuck. Maybe change. Okay. Yeah. Maybe a plug or something is loose. Maybe that's why the light might be still on. Sorry I never make it to the stream. That's alright, man. I don't expect everybody to make it to every stream. People are busy. People have lives. People are work. People go to school. You know? People are spending time with family. That kind of thing. So, yeah, I don't expect everyone to catch every single stream. It's just, it's, it, that's, some people can, because they have absolutely nothing to do, but it is a bit impossible to always catch every stream. It, it, it just is. I honestly thought that Marlin was coming up to my bait. It rushed so quick. I'm not sure, bro. It's hopefully going to the garage tomorrow. Oh, you've already booked it into the garage, have you, Trippy? Fish on. Only that one. Now hopefully it doesn't cost too much, man. Let's hope. Who is TG? Yeah, typical gamer, yeah. Yeah. Most people call him TG for short. Yeah, he's absolutely awesome guy, man. Really, I, I respect everything he does. Not just... There's just so many things. How positive he is. He's, he's funny. He's great at his game play. He doesn't just play one game. He does play a lot of Fortnite, but he plays a mixture of other games and shows new games as well. Which is the same as what I'm about. He's about the same as kind of like how I am, you know. I try and make things funny. I try and be good at the game. I try and show tips and tricks. And I try to show new games. And he does the same as me as well. He grinds. He streams every single day, man. It's, the YouTube grind is always it's always a real thing. Like he's got 10 million. Oh, we got a big Marlin. He's got 10 million subscribers, but he still sticks on the grind. He doesn't back off. He's still he's still grinding it, and still you can never get to the top, you know. There's always going to be someone else who has more subscribers, and I don't think he's too much into about how many subscribers he's just into about he's just into about having a good time and yeah i like him man i used to watch a lot of nick a30 as well i don't know if you know him i used to watch him all the time literally all the time then he moved over to twitch never ever watched him ever since that day so oh you haven't put it booked it in yet no not yet he is actually streaming now and i am a fan since gta yeah he's a great guy man Big respect to TG. Love that guy. Yeah, yeah. He's got lots of different words that he uses. 10 million, well, yeah. He hasn't, lo it wasn't too long ago that he hit 10 million. I forgot to take the reel up. Oh, we're probably going to lose this one. That was at 60 for a while. Yeah, I know PewDiePie, yeah. I watch some of his stuff, not too much though. Not because I don't like him, and not because of the content, I just... It's just hard for me trying to watch too many other people, trying to get the time in. When I'm streaming myself all the time and making videos myself, it's kind of hard for me to try and make time for to watch other people stream or making videos. But TG, I watch him every day. 
Even if it's only for half an hour. I still watch him every day. We lost this one, lads. We lost it. I left it at 60 for too long. I can't stop it. It's too big. Gone. Even if I didn't have it at 60, I still don't think we would have been able to get, keep that one. That's just the way of the road sometimes. We got some big waves there. See what? Didn't see that. Exactly. That's the way it is. Nobody saw that. There we go. We're learning. <laughs> Nobody saw that. I love it. Uh, I think that Marlin there was coming, but he changed his mind. <laughs> Probably thought it was too far. Too much of a swim for him. Couple up that way. Can I change the time whilst be Okay, I can. Right, let's go 6 a.m. I want to see how far in the morning I can actually go. Um, probably could do 5.30 as well, actually. Let's try 5.30. Look at that. Sun's, sun's on its way up. It looks beautiful. Hey, <laughs> our phone is slow as Jack. What phone do you have? I know you said you were, you like Android, don't you? I'm pretty sure you said that. Was it you who said Android? I'm sure it was. Why oh, a media pad? T three seven. You love Android and iOS. I don't mind iOS. Like, I'm not against it. But I've just always had iPhones. I have had the odd... I've had the odd um, Android phone here and there. I'm not against... As I said, I'm not against Android, but... Um, I probably would say I prefer an iPhone. And that's just probably... Uh, the only reason I can think of why I like it more is because that's just what I've always had. Uh, we're not seeing any fish at the minute. Maybe 5.30 could be too early. Oh, there's a c oh wow, okay. Maybe not. They've all just appeared out of nowhere. Doesn't come with a flashlight. Or even a 4K camera. Yeah, but sometimes it's not always about having a, a good camera and and that kind of thing. It's not always it's not always about that. Like there's a lot of apps on Android compared to what you can get on an iPhone. Some of the some of the apps that you get on Android are not available on iPhone, so You have the advantages of a lot of many different, a lot of many different um, apps. That's for sure. I also got a brand. Oh, we got a fish on. What rod? That one. Also got a brand new electronic rear rear view mirror with a DVR recorder built in so I can record my journeys in my car. Front and back cams will help if I need to make an insurance claim. Yeah, that's good. Should also tell your insurance company that as well. And then they'll they'll actually give you um they actually give you a bit of percentage off by by doing that. By having a camera on board. Yeah, good idea. You can make a dash cam video. Want to become a member? 
Oh, okay. <laughs> <clears throat> I do that every now and again. I start reading out at night, but just read down the list. Just read one after the other. And Nightbot ends up getting a shout out. <laughs> 266. Oh man, we are so close. Come on. I just need that one. You can, oh, when you read that, it made me laugh, no joke. <laughs> are you back at school now, are you? Because I remember you saying you're getting back to school soon. Are you back at school now? My kids are all back tomorrow. On a rainy day. Oh, well, there is a lot, a lot of fish over there. Oh, my jeez, look at that. That is insane how many's over that way. Wow, there is a lot. My eye keeps going blurry. Can't see. To be honest, the most exciting video they are going to get. Every time I go to read chat, we get a fish on. There we go. Another marlin. Um, when was I up to? To be honest, the most exciting video they are going to get is a quick trip to the garage, laugh out loud. I never really go anywhere. Yeah, but it doesn't, doesn't matter, does it? As long as if you've got, if you're carrying cameras on board all the time, you can prove that it wasn't you who caused the accident. So now make your insurance company make it a little bit cheaper for you. You could say that you'll always have video evidence of a crash. If you ever did crash or someone ever crashed into you, you'd have you'd have video evidence of that. It's okay if they crash into you. But if you crash into them and you've got that on recording, <laughs> obviously your insurance price is gonna go up. Do bear that in mind. <clears throat> My mum is making me do online learning. Well that's good man. If you're not at school you should always spend that time. Spend that time trying to learn out, out elsewhere, whether it's online or just writing things down on a bit of paper, doing some maths or learning how to write neater. Even buying a book and writing exactly everything that's in that book, copying it, it helps. I only go to school when they have a test and then I leave when it test is done. It's a shame that the kids are not back at school, but in some way it's also good because you know, there's a chance that there's a chance they can catch COVID. That's really not a good thing. Clearly not. You can, in that case, the format button accidentally got pressed. <laughs> I ain't said nothing, Trippy. I ain't said anything. <laughs> I never heard you say a word. We're running out of live bait. We got 14 live bait left, but it's okay. This should, should, should get us to level 21. Come on. It's, I'm hoping it's going to be this one. Honestly, my right eye keeps getting blurry. It's falling asleep. I don't know why. This is not the time that I sleep. <clears throat> I'm getting it there. Let's get in there. 50 feet. Don't think that's quite big enough to get us to 21. It might. It's going to get us pretty close though. 1,771 XP, 237 in weight, 1,180 cash, and release for 354 XP. Oh my gosh, that is so close. That is so close. One more. One more Marlin. Uh, we got that weird glitch. Let's change rod. Let's change back. There we go. 
one more mile and we hit 21 and we'll be able to get those better rods just one that's all we need <clears throat> I have to go I have to go guys bye enjoy your self guys see you later good good luck grinding the hope that car gets fixed trippy well next fish should that should yeah it should make us get up there but thanks for dropping by again BG man I'll catch you later Oh wow, didn't even move. There we go. That one isn't gonna do it, surely not. No, I didn't think so. I just need one, one more marlin, and we'll be able to get them better rods. That'll be so much better. I think I feel like I should do a 180 there. There is so much fish there. Let's go back through again. I had a feeling that was going to come to it. I see the way it turned. I don't even need this one to be too big. As long as I manage to get this one in. That'll make us level up. I've never seen both of the rods go at the same time. That's one thing I haven't seen. I don't know if you can catch a fish on the other rod while she got one on. Although that float does keep on moving a lot though. The amount of times it's gone under. It hasn't stayed under though, so... I don't know if there is a fish on there. Hold on, it's under again. No, it's come back up. Let me... Oh, I can't... Wrong button. Let me change it to this button. Hmm. I don't know. Is that a fish there? No, it's not. That's too far away. It doesn't show there is a fish there. Come on, stop running. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Man, I even backed the line off. Are you kidding me? I backed the line off. Look how beautiful that looks. I did back the line off for there. I don't know why. That's bugged out, isn't it? That's bugged out. That is by far the most beautiful looking graphics I've ever seen on a fishing game. It really is. Until I until I see another one. <laughs> Until I see a better game. This is this is, yeah. There's one there. There we go. That didn't take long. I don't want it to fight to the end of the earth. I just need to get it in. Get it in and we'll be good. Come on. I might have to drop it down from 75. That carries on like that. Oh, wow. Cannot stop it. I'm interested to see how much better the other rods do. Really am. Um. 
I don't know what max level is on this as well. I don't know if you, once you get to level 20, that's it. That's max level. Or whether it keeps going. No idea. Oh, wow. Almost lost it there. Almost broke. Come on, man. Stop running. That's enough. You made your point. You're strong. Oh, there's another one there. Look. Come on. Come on. I'm slowing it. I'm slowing it. No. Maybe not. <laughs> it's going again. 580, 590, 600. It's running strong now. There's a lot of fish around. Uh, we're getting it back now. I almost overdid it there on the reel. Kept my finger on too long. Whew. Some of them really, you really do have to focus proper for some of them. Especially if you're trying your best not to lose that fish. You really do have to proper focus on what you're doing. This will definitely get us to level 21. Then we can get the better rods and reels. Come on. I'm hoping it don't run again. I just want to hit level 21. I really want to get them rods. I might not even have to sell it. I might be able to keep it. No, okay. Maybe this isn't going to get us to it. Let's see. Oh, it did. There we go. Perfect. <sighs> At long last, level 21. Let's buy the better rods. <laughs> no, well, no wasting. No time wasting. I don't really need that rod anymore. I don't know if that put. Does that put it into my backpack or. Rods. That's my inventory. Feeder rods. Fly rods. Casting rods. I really don't know. Hmm. <clears throat> okay, so for one and okay, let's let's buy one for there. Okay, rods, rods, store, casting rods, or feeder rods. Actually, I could try a feeder rod. What's that? That's one twenty-eight durability. I think the casting rod's going to be better. Yeah. Okay, that's a lot better. Okay, let's buy that one. Buy. Equip. And then we need a reel. Cast and reel. We get the best reel we can possibly buy. That's 130. My chairs, stop moving. Uh, that reel. Buy. Equip that. The best thing is, is now we can get some of that awesome strong line there look at that 142 pound buy and equip perfect uh hooks hook 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 now we can use that 12 hook i weren't meant to buy it i weren't meant to sell i was meant to buy what is going on why can i not equip it on there okay Nobody saw that. We gotta buy a float. <laughs> okay, there we go. Equip. Now we can put a hook. There you go. Twelve. Equip. Perfect. And then bait. I think we did need to buy a few more bait, didn't we? Actually, we was low on that. Yeah. All right. 
Let's spam that. Let's buy a bit of that. Stock up on that. There we go. That's 58. Oh man, this chair is annoying. Okay. And then... I don't know if... It just says buy. I can't sell it. Okay, but I go like that. Uh, home storage. There it is. So I could sell it. I'm not going to sell it though. So rod number one. Mm. So number... I should really put it in that slot there. So let's remove that one. And... I can remove... So I don't need... I can keep that there. I don't really need 4 and 5 anymore. Even though 4 and 5 does do the job. Um, I'm Jack that watched you live stream Fishing Planet. What game is this? This is called Ultimate Fishing Simulator, man. Okay, so we got a rod there. Let's buy another heavy duty rod for rod slot 2. I'm going to buy one of those reels. And then rods casting. Might as well buy the same one, aren't There's no point in me going for that one. Might as well get two of the same. If I get two of the same, and then that way I'll be able to put on some really crazy heavy duty rods. Uh, some really heavy duty fish on there, should I say. Okay, reels. Let's go to float. Buy. Equip that. Reels. Casting. Equip. No, I pressed. <laughs> I brought it. I pressed the wrong button. Oh well, doesn't matter. Strategy gaming. How's it going, man? Welcome to the channel. Um. Okay, and then hooks. Give me a sec, guys. I'm a little bit slow going at the minute. I'm just buying new rods. So that way we can catch some of those insane big fish. Okay, that's that. Oh, there. Line. Might as well buy a bit of that. Never know. Okay, baits. Now we're going to catch some. Now we are going to catch some big, big fish. Okay, so we got that one, we got that one. They could mess around with that one, mess around with that one. I haven't got any spinning rods, but I haven't got any. F There's also fly rods as well. There, there we go. Yeah, so we could also buy the that fly rod. I haven't actually brought any fly rods or any fly spinning reels, so I'm definitely am going to give that a shot at some point. But for now. I want to catch something bigger than 400 pound. I want to catch something bigger than 400, so let's see if we can do that. Look at that. Okay, there we go. I gotta, I gotta pick that one up first. E and then Q. Then back to our other rod. There we go. Them rods look quite nice, man. I'm going to be honest. They do look really good. I like the look of them. Not when it lights up orange when you're near it. <laughs> Not so much that. They look really shiny and that reel as well. That reel looks really good. Okay. we got two heavy duty um, rods out there. Okay, let me just... Okay, so 12 hook and we got the live bait on there. I'm just checking because I didn't... Sometimes it doesn't always apply the right hook. Uh, 12 hook on there and live bait. Okay, perfect. Let's have a look if there's any fish around. Of course there isn't. Let me change time. Oh, my controller vibrated. Okay, there we go. Well, considering there weren't no fish around, that one just appeared out of nowhere. 
kind of strange, but I ain't complaining. We should be able to put more strain on this now. Oh, wow, okay, maybe not. I honestly thought I would have been able to. Can I not take that up to... No, I can't take that up to 86. But then this... this oh, wow. This could be a really big fish, though. Before, we had the 10 hook on. This is the 12 hook. So it could it could be bigger than it could be bigger than four hundred pound. I honestly thought by buying this better reel and the better rod and the line, I thought I was going to be able to reel it in a lot quicker. I was a little bit wrong. <laughs> These are big, massive fish, though, so that explains it. Still swimming really strong. I can't take it up above that. Let's try 86 now. It would just break on 86. I know it will. 71 it is. Yeah, it's got us out to over 600 foot. Now 650. Seven hundred feet, still going. There is one good thing about it doing this. At least we know it's definitely gonna be a big fish. Eight hundred feet still going. I'm reeling, but it's still going. This is not as easy as what I thought it would be. I honestly thought, yeah, okay, we get them, we get the better rods. This is going to be easy. 850 foot. And we're starting to get it back a little bit. It's kind of pulling line, but we're, we're kind of bringing it in at the same time. There we go. I'm interested to see how big this is. This could be our, our new record biggest fish. It's a bigger hook. It's a bigger hook. Rather than us using the 10, we're using the 12 hook. Bigger hook, bigger fish. At least that's the theory. <laughs> I hope so. It still ran really well though. But instead of a thousand feet, now we can let it run to 1,300, so that helps. That definitely helps. Another one there. I'm not sure how big it is. It probably isn't going to be above 400, is it? May it just be my luck. Only time will tell. There we go. It's getting in close now. I'm going to back the reel off a little bit just in case it tries to run. Oh, wow. That is our biggest. There's a lot bigger out there than that. They got to one and a half thousand, but still 421 pound. Nearly 3000 XP. We can get 584 for releasing, but this time I'm going to keep it because we did... Well, not keep it, but sell it, because this time we did spend a bit of money. Now we've got 67,000 cash. That's pretty cool. That's our new biggest fish. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Let me just scan really quick. Last time I did that, I scanned the area. I see nothing. And then we started driving, or went to drive. Then we had a fish there. Now we can actually look for those bigger spots now. Those bigger green spots. Before we had to kind of avoid them. Now we got the better rods and reels. Now we can get them. I knew that was coming for it. It swam straight towards the boat. I was going to say it, but I didn't want to jinx it. The 
Oh wow. I thought my lime was gonna break there. Oh wow. It did break. I tried push it I tried bit pushing it too much. I shouldn't have done that. I don't know why I did that. Yeah, I don't know why I did that. I pushed it too much. That float isn't sitting too good. Let me cast it a bit further, see if it sits better. Could be because it's too close. That float's sitting really strange. Maybe it could be the depth, yeah. Okay, let me change that. Let's try that. There we go, that's a bit better. That float's not it's not a very big float though. It's gonna make it harder to to see it. That's alright. Let me just adjust this one real quick as well. Um, oh wow. I think we got some interest there. We got some interest. My controller just vibrated. There's nothing around. This is strange. Maybe I should get a different float. That float. Can't really see it. Floats. I don't know what float I had on there before. Okay, so that one I can see. It must have been that one. That, no, that's the one I've already got. Okay. Let's do that. That should make it stick up more. There we go. Yeah, that's better. That's more like it. Okay, then. Oh, well, wow, there's a fish on there. Okay. I told you I heard it vibrating. Marlin? Yeah. I felt the controller vibrate. And I, I wondered what it was, but I didn't see any of the floats moving. There was a fish on there. Can't force it. I'm gonna take my time with it. I think 71 is a bit of a scary one to use. The bar goes up to the red and it stays in the red for quite a long time. Like that. Makes me think it's gonna break, whereas if the 57, it doesn't stay up as long. I think 57 is a little bit too weak, but I think the other one's a little bit too strong. So that one, it works. So that's the main thing. This is where it's quite easy now to earn money. Now we got the better rods. There's not really anything that we need to buy. <clears throat> oh wow. No, 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 no. I pressed the wrong, all the wrong buttons there. I'm surprised I didn't lose that. I didn't think it was going to run. Yellow fin tuna. Yeah, that's another thing that's just popped up there. Someone caught. We haven't really had many of those. But to be honest, that is because I, that isn't what I've really gone to try and catch. 
That's not what I've been trying to catch. They are nice looking fish though. Okay, hopefully it shouldn't run the second time. There we go. 242 pound. 1,198 cash. That's pretty decent. Would you look at that? I just want to show you night time again. Look at that. Wow. That looks so good, man. I love that. <laughs> All right, well, we finally got the rods and we got, well, and we got the reels. I will, <laughs> I will end up buying a... There we go. I will end up buying a DLC uh, probably tomorrow, so we'll show that. I'm not sure if we're going to stream at our normal time or later. Probably it will be later because obviously i got to pick the kids up from school. But I'm going to end it there. And um, yeah, I'm going to end it there. We've been streaming for a little bit now. So how long have we been streaming? Just over four hours. So I hope you guys did enjoy this one. Thank you everyone who did drop a like on the stream as well. Yeah, that was pretty good. I kind of enjoyed that one. We did. We caught a lot of fish. Like an insane amount of fish, and we managed to buy a lot of new gear as well, so that's good. So yeah, next time we play this, I probably am going to be playing this tomorrow, but if I don't and we play something else, I don't know if I'm going to play this or Tony Hawk's or... Yeah, I'm not sure yet. We'll wait and see. We'll see what tomorrow brings, what kind of mood I'm feeling in. But yeah, thanks for sitting with us, man. I know you don't really like fishing. I appreciate you still being here, though, Trippy. It's always good, man. Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this one. That's it. We'll catch you people again soon for some more fun and games. I'm out.